fantastic. Are you good? No, we're sounding pretty good. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, so far. You so. can hear me, yeah? I can hear you some. This so is actually I'll the best I've ever heard everybody in the okay. first two seconds of, a, of one of us. I'm working on it. See, we, we, see I need improved. you to talk more. <laughs> I'm so, talking, Anthony. Don't have to yell. <laughs> I'm talking. Do, we, do, we, do you I want that regular window talking. closed? Or you I'm regular talking. Keep it open. It gets too hot right in here. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't want to know if the neighbors would be annoyed. Um, no. I mean, they, they every once in a while, we'll hear noises from, you know, yeah. that person. Now, they, they, they know to keep the, the windows closed. Oh. oh wow! Yeah, because we fuck loud. Call him Trey Sauce. Neighbors knows know his name. Really? <laughs> <laughs> no. I mean, I could be really also, mean right now, but I won't be. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not saying like our our windows are so close together. You're not going to hear some shit. Um, but there are a, other reasons. I mean, why. you hear a lot of stuff if you have neighbors that close. Like, yeah, you're always. Gonna I hear that. their baby all the time. Yeah, um, it's it would just be understood. I mean, if they if they had the windows open, they'd hear my TV. Yeah, mm. you just state everything you want to say. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm expecting a, a long segment of uh, of of Leland uh, catches up on the podcast. <laughs> Not really. I I was gonna take notes, and then I was like, I thought you I did. Don't, I don't care enough about it. I thought about it. This it let me rephrase it. It's not that I don't care. No, it sounds like you don't care. No, no, it's not that I don't care. I just there would be no point. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, like what? What are we gonna do? Like, yeah. apologize? <laughs> yeah, no. I mean, I, I've known you for over almost twenty years. I've known them for like what five now? That sounds Has about been right. Yeah. It, it's been a while. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, I consider us all like really, really good friends at this point. Yeah. So who cares? Like at this, I'm like, I know there was no malice intent towards no, it. You know what not. I mean? No, um, I want to know though. <laughs> it's it's just busting your balls. I um. So are we, are we going? Like, oh yeah, no, it's it's already started. I mean, it's mm-hmm. on. We are the Gabby's gang. Love to talk all day. Don't know what we are saying on the League of Ridiculous Conversation. You, you, and nothing has been gold at this point for you. I don't know. I thought it was pretty funny about busting your balls. <laughs> oh, well, uh, okay. Well, let's get the negative out of the way up front. Oh, um, oh, no, no, it's, it's more or less towards myself. Okay. Wait, uh, what? You look like you're looking at a list. No, no he's, he's still looking at the penguin. Oh, you're squishing the penguin. The, the, the stress yeah, penguin. You put a squishy in front of me. I want to play with it. The pod, um, yeah. the pod guin. The pod. No, I'm done. Um, <laughs> I don't want to play with this anymore. You gave it a dumbass name. <laughs> um, no, so I've listened. I'm up to date except for the one you put up today. today. Okay. okay. Um, That's fair. Okay. Because, I, you know, I'm bored. Yeah. Um, I mean, you drove. You had to drive up here today, right? No, I was here yesterday. Okay, oh, okay. that's fair. Yeah. So you'll listen to it on the way home. Probably. That but I just sad. realized yeah. that Hollywood Babylon's back too. So also that's, true. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, so thoughts. Okay. Uh, I want to go on record as apologizing. I told you this already. <laughs> oh, um, God. I- I'd like to go on. Who, what's her name? Which one? <laughs> Rebecca? We've only had two no. people. No. Oh, we've had, so, uh, we've had, right. we've had Rebecca. Rebecca, we've had Gally. Well, um, no, not her, cause I know her, so she's I can't fine. fucking, why am I why blinking you, out? What here, are you, to the side, here to the side, here to the side. That's still no, Gally? No, not Gally. Caitlin! I don't know. Oh, that. Caitlin, yeah. I don't know that name. Uh, Sergeant Swift Stitch? I'm definitely not going to know that name. Okay. <laughs> she listens. And she's hurt right now. I, I'm sorry. I, sorry I don't know who you are. Sorry, it's not nothing rude. I'll, I'll, I'll fix this. I'll fix this. Caitlin, it's okay. Don't worry. Whisper Daddy's here. Okay. Oh, it's, I, I don't remember. Whisper Daddy. <laughs> okay. Who, whoever. It, it's a bit. It's, it's, it's the lady that um, who basically called me out saying like, well, I don't know you either. You suck or whatever. She Sounds said, like Rebecca. Rebecca. And, and I was kind of like. No, she's right. I was like, she's right. I do not know her. And I, I lashed out the last time I was on the show because, yes. because I'm sad that I'm not here anymore. So I lash out at the guests that take my spot. I will say this though, without me, there would have been no podcast. So I just want to throw oh, that out. True. I mean, yeah. he, he is the godfather of this podcast. Uh, true. Yeah. That's not the point. Point is, I apologize to all those people that take, who, who fill in while I'm not here. I don't know you. I'm jealous. They don't deserve your wrath. They don't deserve my wrath. <laughs> um, 
And that's all. I just wanted. To, I, I, was, I was like, I felt bad because okay. she sounded like a wonderful person on the podcast. I was like, <laughs> I was like, oh shit, me and this bitch could hang. Yeah, no, like, that was oh, like, yeah. that was like my thought. I was if, like, oh damn, she would have been a new friend. You if, know, if like, the <laughs> both of you were in the same room, there would be nothing left of me. <laughs> Nice. Um, Jesus. What do you mean by that? <laughs> you you both rip him apart. Yeah. Oh, I thought this was like a sex thing. I was like, no, well, no, it doesn't have to be. I'm done with. Like, but I just and then and then you had the gentleman who Jeremy. Sure. I'm just um, remembering like recent boat, racing boat, yes. boatman works at a boat Jeremy. shop. Jeremy. Jeremy. Okay, that dude was cool too. Yeah. Um. It. Okay. So he didn't introduce him. At one point, no, no, actually, I, no, I don't think at all. For about thirty minutes, yeah, I thought it was you, and the audio was bad. <laughs> I did. Oh. I was like, man, Anthony, you got really bad at your audio. Like Jordan sounds all high and low. You know, like I don't Jordan, know what's going on. Jordan's actually going to be a new problem now with his new masks. Yeah. But I'm more the, muffled now. And the, and, yeah. the, and the only time I started to realize, well, when I text you, I was just like, who the fuck is this on the show? Yeah. And the other reason was just because you start, he started talking about his job, and I was like, no, I think I would have heard if Jordan yeah. decided to quit his <laughs> well, job and become a boat guy. You know, I'm like, I'm, I, I'm a boat man. Not, not that we ever like, ta-da, unless it's a brand new person, then I try and make sure I say their name the first like 10 minutes. Sure. But like, it's never been our gig to No, it hasn't. Proper and unfortunately, yeah. okay, but, but there was about 20 minutes of prior conversation before the podcast that I had to cut out because we discovered so much about Steph at the oh, end. Yeah. Yes. That um, it just, it pushed out like 20 minutes of D&D talk. Yeah, yeah. We'll get to you in a minute. <laughs> um, wow. But. Oh, well, he's got to catch up on like two months. Of- so I will admit though, so I do apologize for all those people that I, I, it's, it's not personal that I don't know you. It's, I lashed out. I was, cause, <laughs> because I'm jealous that I miss you guys. That yeah. like, I have my friends and I, well, you know all my friends. So yeah. it's like, um, and, and I have a really good time up there. I'm not podcasting with them. No, I am not. And, um, but. Well, you are. I am, but, but not. It's but not the same. It is not the same. And I do enjoy the podcast I'm doing up there. And then incidentally, because I am so low maintenance here, mm-hmm. as far as we have show no routine, up. Yeah. show up and just do, <laughs> do it. it. Yeah. That that is also transferred into my new one. Oh, and I oh need you got to, lazy already? I got lazy within two episodes. <laughs> so I need to remember the when we record this week or next week, I need to be like, hey, welcome. This is yeah. this show. Yeah. We are these people, and this is what we do or here. You know. record a prior intro, generic intro, and then just play that first. I'm trying to get... I'm having a hard time figuring out what I want it to be. Yeah. Um, like my and room, this is the Spook Easy Podcast. The Spook Easy Podcast. Here, you can use this. <clears throat> Welcome to the Spook Easy Podcast. I don't know how I'm going to get that. I can send it to He's you. Send Thank it you. To you. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, you under the impression I'm good at stuff. <laughs> He's been trying to get Roll20 roll, roll 20. working. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I, I even used it. I downloaded it. I was like, I downloaded it. I went, I signed up. Yeah. And I looked at it. I'm like, cool. Now what? <laughs> it's, like, it's like looking at Photoshop for the first time. Yeah. It's like, I don't know. I'm like, unless I'm on with someone, this is a very useless thing right now. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Which is also true. Yeah. So I'm like, mm, until I have someone to be on here with yeah. me. Mm. Or you know it enough that you do all the back work. Sure. Before and other people I would love to it. figure all that out. It's yeah. just, it's a hard, I just, I don't understand. Something. Well, we're, we're going to get to it. We're going to get to it. Um, you know, maybe get a couple other people in, you know, if it's just, you know, all it takes is just be consistent once a week. You know, hang out for three, four like hours. Go online and online go on Roll Twenty. And I mean, roll three, 20 four just... hours is a lot. <laughs> I feel like I mean, this is a lot three, easier to do, three. though. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> Bless you. Now Bless you. Now you're just begging for attention. Okay. See, that's why I wear the mask. <laughs> Yeah, to protect um, himself from your germs. <laughs> <laughs> I apologize. You're um, fine. It, it just like yeah, because. So we're doing the new podcast. Is Spook Easy the Spook Easy? The yeah. Spook Easy. You can find it. Please download. You do not have to. <laughs> the um, Spook Easy podcast. <laughs> Ooh, that's a bumper. <laughs> Sounds like a gay Frankenberry. Oh my god! Um, Only on. Or, oh no, we can get that up more. We can get that up more. Jordan, can I get twenty percent more gay on that? <laughs> a higher or deeper? Oh, gayer. deeper. Just gayer. <laughs> Just okay. deeper. Dealer's choice. Yeah, deeper. What does that sound like? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know yet. Anyway. Well, can I get more Paul Lynn on that? The Spook Easy Podcast. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh. I know that guy. Um, <laughs> so, 
it was so like I I don't think no, I don't think any of you guys have met Matt or Shane. Mm. No, I don't think so. Were they not at um Knott's They were not Club? at WonderCon or not, no. Okay. Um, I didn't even see you at WonderCon. Yeah, I found out later you guys were there. <laughs> um, I was just like, Oh, that would have been cool. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know what else would have been cool? Going to the Boys and Berry Festival together. Yes, it would have. Yeah, get would there. Have. We'll get there. Okay. I have, I, okay. I'm, I'm going through the list in my mind right now. <laughs> Chronological order. Uh, so the only, the only per, you, honestly, the only person at this table who has no notes is him. <laughs> That's true. I don't have notes. <laughs> oh, you have notes. I'm uh, not going to lie. I have, have one sticky note. You have notes. But there's uh, only two things on it. But like, so we're doing the first podcast. It's working. We're like, Shane's a good dude. Matt's mm-hmm. a good dude. Like, they're both very into horror and fun and like it's a good it's a good mix of yeah. people yeah mm-hmm. um i feel inspired again i was like oh this is all cool good. and then they drop well i knew shane was younger than me oh, oh no like i knew he was younger i did he's because he because I mean, he had just come back from graduating college so okay. i was like oh you're like okay, 25 I was, I was like 25 can we all take guests <laughs> well hold on so, well well this one's like, so shane's 24 so I, okay. Okay, yeah Shane, i got him down i was like oh cool and they're they're buddies right yeah you know you know them through each other yes okay um and so then when uh i got very uncomfortable when matt told me how old he was and i was like Oh no! Like that. How how old is he? He's he just turned twenty one. <laughs> oh. And he and he's graduated college. No, no, that's Shane. Oh, no, oh. Matt, Matt is his a different. He's his own person. Okay, um, I was gonna say who's, is he who's into this the party Dookie Hauser motherfucker? Is he just starting the party scene. No, he's not a partier per okay. se. He, but they're both actors. Oh. Um, ha- has he tasted the devil's juice? Oh, I don't think so. Oh wow! Um, uh, Smoke the devil's lettuce. Oh, I can guarantee. <laughs> what you know? That's their company, right? Really? <laughs> Who's? The Devil's the Lettuce? The DNL. Oh, really? That's their company name, Devil's Lettuce. Fuck me. I yeah. did not know I want all their stickers. <laughs> oh, I've got done and done. <laughs> yes. I have wow. so many stickers. Yes. That's, that's I, amazing. I'm the biggest <laughs> proponent that doesn't smoke for them. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, I, I have I have a hoodie. Or no, I, what, what's a beanie? I guess oh, oh, dude, you have a beanie? Cool. I yeah, wear I beanies. Beanie. I, I do, too. Sweater. Yeah, no. Uh, My head I'll, gets cold. I'll... I'll I'll see what I can do. Um, yeah, it's called Devil's Lettuce. Your head don't fit no beanie. That's interesting. I, 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 I don't it. know where you locate their shit. I do, I just go to their house. The so store. like I just you know. Um, so it, we when he when he was like he was, I was just like well wait how old are you and he was just like oh you know I'm, I'm, I just turned twenty one heart stop <laughs> just and I was like I'm I'm sorry am I hanging out with people that are literally <laughs> the age of gentlemen. I could have birth sons too. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they are the age I could legitimately have them as children. No. If I had a baby at 20. Not at 20. What, were you saying I couldn't have a baby at 20? No, I'm saying That's you not totally very nice, could. Anthony. I mean, you totally could, but the, your baby wouldn't be 21 and 25. Like if you're maybe I'm, 17. I'm saying in the range. In like, the in the uh, range. Of, of course, I had to make you it. You could have had a baby that could be dating one of them. And then again, I did. <laughs> then of course, I had to make it extremely awkward when they were like, "Oh yeah, we're in our 20s," and I was just like, "Oh my god, I could be your daddy <laughs> if that's what you want." <laughs> you know, <it's> like, <laughs> Jesus Christ, <laughs> so, mm, horror daddy. <laughs> I was like, mm, <laughs> lay away. Um, Jesus <laughs> <Christ>. <laughs> <laughs> Is that wrong? Yeah. Um, so anyway. Both so, very cool. Yeah. Um, yeah one, but, one, one thing really quick. Sure. Uh, we now have a whisper daddy and a horror daddy. Aww. I'll be a horror daddy. <laughs> I'll be a whisper daddy. Um, yes. Okay. Thoughts on Steph's brows. They don't look as frightening as I envisioned. <laughs> oh, thank you. Uh, no, no. Quick, quick uh, add on. They're not usually the star. She yeah. clearly no, no, just she, got, she yeah. let me know. Okay. That was the first thing she said. When you all left, I looked at her, she goes, they're not usually the star. Yeah. <laughs> like, it will fade. They, like, they do look more natural. I think they look, yeah. I was more concerned that you would look like a clown. Oh, thanks. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because we had a family friend that had the brows, the, um, Eyeliner. Eyeliner yeah. and the lips yeah. all done at the same time. Oh, no. oh, oh she looked like Pennywise. Like it was <laughs> absolutely frightening. The I learned one? you could get cheap blush tattooed now. Yeah, I think she did that as well. And like, I was like, really? Nice. Why? In, in, in her, she was just like, well, I don't like no, f- you know, no, no, f- was it no mess, no m- fuss? What's the f- no fuss, no mess? You something like that? I was like, yeah, but you look like a clown. <sighs> like, you continuously look like you're going to be holding a balloon like it, and you're a child. It, it, it makes sense <laughs> to me of, like, 
a base, something that you're always going to work up from. Sure. But to just tattoo your whole makeup regiment, one is committing a lifetime to the same look, which I can't do. Yeah. Uh, mm. But <laughs> but <laughs> also you, seems Madonna. also seems bananas. <laughs> He's a free spirit. Yeah. Just like Madonna, every five years I will get onto the new trend and try and milk it for all it's worth. Oh, did you see what she did this week? Oh, no, God. of course I didn't. Oh, well, her she threatened a new a new album. <laughs> comes out on June 14th. Okay. Um, did you hear about any of you? You didn't hear any of this? I did, no, no. Cause, uh, oh, you, this is, cause you misspoke and you said she threatened new, uh, uh, no, I did not want, I don't want no, no. that in my life. Hold, hold on your ass. So get this shit. So 14 track new album. Okay. Uh, hmm? each tr- Madonna. Madonna. Oh, Madonna. Okay. Each track is a different song inspired by a different culture. Oh, Jesus. And it's done with the, um, uh, she's going to do personas. Oh no! Yeah, it's Gross. a concept album. Ooh, no, that's an appropriation what? album. I guess when you do your 14th studio album, you just run out of things to do. Oh, oh, what God. exactly are the places she's trying to? Well, she's been living in like um, some some South. South. <laughs> no, no, no. That's no, no. That's... She's not going to do like an accent and then like oh, make the will. music theme. I don't know. The first single was all in Spanish, um, mm. except for her portions, which okay. were like auto tune English. Now the dude, I don't know who he is Pitbull. singing. It was not <laughs> um, who was ever singing. Whoever was singing the English port or the Spanish portion. Sure, I'm sure he's great. Yeah, where he comes from and. Uh, I mean, it's either Spain Ooh, or Mexico. I'm not quite sure. <laughs> <laughs> but like, it was kind of like. It could be Ricky Martin. Cool, man. It was not could Ricky, be Ricky Martin. Martin. No, it okay. was not. Uh, and I was like, cool. This was the first Madonna album in years that I was like, huh. Not even. Well, I guess I'm gonna wait and see how this all hears before I decide to buy it. Really? <laughs> that has yeah. never happened. Wow. Like you know. I've been through thick and thins with this bitch. Like, <laughs> <it's> like <laughs> but I, I, I feel like some of those albums were the last two albums have been awful. Like, yeah, yeah, but like, but those two albums, you'd be like, mm, I'm gonna hear all this. Like, you've gone this far before, like being like, I gotta hear something on every track before committing yeah. to the presale. I mean, yeah, and I, this is, like, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. I, I, I haven't it, done it yet, but I'd rather give my money to Billie Eilish at the moment. It, Hell how yeah. do you yeah. like her? I, God, I like that one video her. I watched. Hell yeah. With the spiders? Yeah. No, a uh, bad guy. With the black... Uh, I saw that one, and I saw the one where she was like in a hallway, and the faces kept changing. Oh, bury a friend. Bury that a friend. one, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, all right, I don't... I'm definitely not the age demographic you're shooting for, but I I like and enjoy your what you what you do and I'm into. Do you know how old she is? Yeah, she's like seventeen. Okay, yeah, yeah. She, she not, seems way mature for being seventeen. She though. played Coachella at yeah. seventeen years old. Um, Don he sat at home for the last two weekends in a row, as he called it, Couchella, oh, and gosh. he just watched it all yeah. high as balls and. Um, his takeaway was he liked Billie Eilish. Yeah. And she scared him, but he likes her. <laughs> um, and he kind of really liked Luzo. Uh, hmm. I don't know who that is. She's this um, big old black girl yeah. who does hip hop kind of pop. But her shtick is that she big, body proud. Yeah. She was all big, like all 300 pounds in a G-string. And I a, think and I know who you're talking about, but I didn't hear sing, her. And all her backup singer and dancers were all plus size models. Yeah. Aww. Like. Uh, it's not music I would listen to, but I respected the hell out of the performance. Like yeah. I was watching, it was just like, oh, I get you. Yeah, okay, yeah. I understand what you're doing. Good for you. I'm glad that there's this is a market yeah. that you had decided it's yours. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean. But it's not music I would listen to. Uh-huh. Fair enough. Um, and that's yeah. how I feel about all of Coachella. Oh, okay. I was like, ah, all music I wouldn't listen to, but I respect that you're out there in the desert for privileged white kids dancing. <laughs> uh, that's that's <laughs> cool for you. Um, I'm just happy I got to watch Charles Gambino do his performance. Yeah, Don was scared by that as well. <laughs> um, he was like, I, he was like, I like Troy, but I don't know what he's doing. And I was like, <laughs> why is Troy so angry? <laughs> why is Troy so angry? <laughs> Uh, and then I told him he about Teddy like a Perkins. Weird spider. Oh, <laughs> yeah, my God. I walked him through Teddy Perkins, and he was just like, "I don't, I don't want to watch that." I was just like, "But you should." I, yeah. I feel like he'd be so impressed by it. He might be. Um, so check, check. Okay, and now to you. Oh. Um, okay, I feel this is probably the longest one. <laughs> probably not. Um, I feel that you poo pooed the presidential suite very quickly on your podcast. <laughs> 
Um, I want to let you know there were 25 people in that place at yeah. all times. It looks like it could fill 25 comfortably. And and there was a TV and it was fucking huge. So I don't know where was you it were than looking. Mine? Huh? Was it bigger than my TV? Uh, yeah, it's the Hilton. It was bigger than the Because it better TV. fucking be. Um, the, the, the room was see. amazing. So it's, I think, no, this is what I think. Right, I think, I'm going to let you finish. I'm going to let you finish. I think you were butt hurt that you didn't get to hang stay. out and you were lashing out at a, 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 a dispense of people who paid for things that you didn't pay for. I, that's what I think, that's what I think happened. Um, now yes, should there have been more rooms? A hundred percent there should have been. Um, but that's not the room we should, got. Should the uh, furniture been maybe a little more impressive? I don't know. It looks better than your house's furniture. And my <laughs> oh, house's I like furniture. a garbage dump. <laughs> I mean, but I mean, it looked better than I have. So, <laughs> I mean, yeah, it could. It would have been from the high end IKEA. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, I feel that you got real down on it because you didn't get to hang out there more. I mean, maybe it would have changed my my overall perception of it because Possible. like we we came in, we were uh real kind of we we needed an hour of rest. Yes. Uh so it was just a lot of just kind of lounging around, some people dozing off and whatnot. Like I I I did my best to to uh actualize how Big it oh, was. Yeah. I imagined it was huge. It was huge. Yeah. 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 I, I showed them the picture. Huge. Like, we all understand it was big. My, I just felt like it didn't match the, 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 the imagination of what a presiden- presidential suite would look like. Sure. But you have to remember, a president only needs one room. <laughs> You know? are not wrong with that. That it's makes not, sense. It's uh, not like we needed, like you guys brought up the hangover suite. Yeah, yeah that needed four rooms yeah. and an adjoining what, big what would you That's call not that room. I, the vice oh, president suite. Sure, I'm just saying <laughs> that this was for one person who was super duper rich. Like this wasn't for a family. This but, isn't like a, but I, a I, I, party I did, atmosphere. I did say it's a lot of space for one bedroom for like one person. I know rich people need more space than us poor people. I don't know how to help you. <laughs> they with need that. nine couches to sit on. They, yeah, they need why. a visual representation of how rich they yeah. are. I, I have it just because. I mean, it was a nice room. Like, look, would I have stayed there by it myself? Was, no, not at all. It was I super impressive. To, so. <laughs> it was impressive. Uh, My I, room I, was nice. <laughs> I, I was not. I was not disappointed by the room. I was. I was impressed. It just didn't match what what I thought a presidential suite would look like before walking into that one. Sure. And I don't know what a presidential suite looked like, nor will I ever see one again. I'm pretty positive. <laughs> but when we were, uh, after you fucked off and we were walking, um, <laughs> this is my new thing. So, uh, I was walking back up with Matthew. Well, fuck me then. Uh, no, 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 like, you did. You were like, I got to go to another party. Peace. You know, and I heard all about your terrible weekend of adventure. I'll tell you my thoughts on off podcast because oh. I'm like, girl, we need to get you. I mean, man, it just let let me help you. Um, but like just living the life of a of a fucking trash goblin. Anyway, um, <laughs> don't sit, don't don't do that. Don't don't think of yourself as that because you're not. I mean, trash kobold. Yes, clearly. Um, but look, it was just um, it, garbage knoll. It, <laughs> <laughs> That's the best one. I used to date him. Pretty um, good. <laughs> it just seems like. After you left, anyway, so we we came back and I yeah. was uh, I went down to the lobby. And that's to get, when the party really started. It did, and unfortunately, you did miss I out missed on it. that. Yeah. Um, I went down to the lobby to pick up Matthew and his friends, and we were coming up, and we were riding the elevator with some woman who was clearly kind of judging us by her facial expressions and huff and puffiness. Jeez. Like it was kind of like. I'm sorry, what's your what, fucking problem? What, yeah. what old white lady is this? Yeah. I don't know. Um, she looked like her name was like Carol with a K. Like, just like, wow. like just a problem altogether. Like, her family also hates her. But she was wearing like. She's a Melissa. Yeah, like, or a Heather, and you know I hate. God Heather. All the names. But anyway, so she was wearing like a, a like a TARDIS hoodie. Like, she was. Oh wait, she's one of us! Kinda. But mm. in the extent of like, I think she was wearing it because her family made her do it. Like, I don't think she's watched Doctor Who. And if All she right. did, she she calls it, you know, Dr. Box. Like, she doesn't get it. Um, <laughs> Dr. Space what? Time. Yeah, Dr. Space Time. <laughs> yeah. So she, we were riding up with her. And me and Matthew, just, you know, we're all just kind of having a conversation or whatever. And she's just like, oh, yeah. And I was like, I'm not invited. But sure, you know, share your thoughts. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> since we're doing this 14-floor uh, journey well, with you, you, man. You're stuck in an elevator. Yeah, but I'm stuck in an elevator with people a lot. And I don't pipe into other people's conversations. Yeah. 
because I, I mean, have respect and integrity and also uh, consciousness. Hey, if if I've got consider a, it, that's the word yeah. I'm looking for. <laughs> if, if I've got a solid zinger, I'm gonna throw it out there. Oh well, no, that's the thing. She didn't, so don't keep your mouth shut. <laughs> uh, you and me, we have solid zingers. So we get off the and she's well, she's walking with us, like yeah. she's heading down the long hallway with us. And I was like, oh, okay. Um, I don't know you. So you're not coming to our room. So <laughs> in my head, she follows you all the way oh, to the door. Like, so she kind of she trails off to her rooms, like a couple rooms down from ours. Okay. And we walk, you saw it, it says presidential suite, yeah. and, and then it's hallway. another hallway. So we walked in, and she goes, oh, God, that's who's in the presidential suite? Oh, okay. God? Oh, right? Fuck right off, I Carol. Was like, I just kind of, I'm like, oh, uh, I had nothing. I really yeah. just, it, she threw me for a loop, and when have I never not had a comeback? Yeah. And, and I got to the room, and, and I was just like, hey, Don, and because she, they kind of, Matthew came and goes, that's who's in the presidential suite? And like Dom was like, what happened? And we quickly told him. And he was like, where's that cunt? Let me go talk to her. And I was just like, he is a little, you know. Yeah. And I was like, oh, damn. We'll close that door. <laughs> yeah. Hold him back. Hold, hold back, bitch. <laughs> So that's it. Those are my thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> the end. Mostly, I just wanted to apologize to the other people because I felt bad. Like, I really did. Oh. Just, I, because she made valid points. She was like, you don't know me. And I was like, I don't know you. And I did. I did. I judged you harshly. Um, but without me, you wouldn't be hearing these people. So, um, you know. So you're welcome. <laughs> I, I mean, I want to say thank you or welcome, but I don't need that. I'm fine. Like, I mean, it, it'd be great if, if we could get, you know, you and another guest, but we only have four mics. That's true. And when we did do it once with five, six people in here, uh, yeah, it was not the first it time. It was not fun. <laughs> it was like, oh God, oh God, this is so close. <laughs> um, so yes, I went to Boysenberry Festival. You sure did. It was yeah, delicious. Did. delicious. I stared at all the so food. Good. I will. Okay. Did you, did you bring us any back? N- no. You piece How? of shit. <laughs> okay. Even I'm not upset. How? Here's here's. How okay. did we get this? So few things. One, a jar of boysenberry. I, I did. I did want to call you guys. They have that as smart and final. Yeah, not they, tap from the source. <laughs> it, trust That's me, true. it's not also Fresh, tap from I wanted, the source. I wanted from the vine. I wanted from the berry like, farm. It, it came from Ohio. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Uh, like, I did want to call you guys, and I, like, I told you outside, I legitimately, like, they won't come. There's no reason to make this phone call. Nice to be invited. I, I'm just, you're right. I do, you're right. It is nice to be invited, and I do apologize. And for next year, I will totally make that call. Okay. Because, I, also, I didn't know what it was. So did you I go did, last year? No, I've never done this before. Oh. I thought it was, a, I've been, oh, it's a Boysenberry Festival. I didn't really think there was one. So when I found that there was one, I was like, damn, okay, we're going. <laughs> um, and I bought a Knott's Pass. Like, I fucking went, like, whole heart. Oh, like, I was okay, just like, okay. I'm in it now. Does, you know, does, it, does that apply to, uh. It does not, because oh. why would it? Uh, um, the only pass I want. Right, exactly. Yeah. Oh, uh, so I have not seen Knott's Berry Farm in the daytime. Yeah. yeah. I in haven't either. Probably in 20 time. years. Ever. Yeah. It's kind of cool in the daylight. <laughs> yeah. not go? Shit you would never know. I, well, I have a pass now. I can, can go for free. Go? That's like 40 I mean, bucks. It, mm, right? It's like 25. Ooh, I swear. Ooh, ooh, More? It's like, it's like 60 bucks. Ew. Yeah. That's girl. also when? why I didn't invite y'all. You didn't want to pay for 60 bucks for a day. I swear yep. it went down to like 40 or 50. Not during Unless Boys was- and Bears Festival. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> They Maybe be, in December when no one wants to go. <laughs> I mean, but they had a really cool deal online, yeah. and, and it's still going right now until the end of April. If you buy a pass, okay. it's twenty dollars down payment and fifteen bucks for five months. Oh, like so they just they just take it out of your checking account for fifteen yeah. dollars a month not for awful. five months, and that's it. I was yeah. like, oh, so it's a hundred dollars. If it ain't gonna get me Scary Farm though, I'm not. I'm not. But you do get it. a discount on Scary Farm tickets. I better get a fat fucking discount on Scary Farm. Well, if, if, hey, if we <laughs> if, yeah. if, if exactly we play our doing. cards right, we all might get the same discount we got last year that you were not a party to. No. So you know, I've got Scott working on that now. Yes, Scott. <laughs> I'll keep telling him to send a muffin basket, but don't <laughs> send boysenberry because that fool probably got enough. <laughs> Scott, um, buddy. So before I tell you all the things that were there, I went to. This is just going to tickle you. you there, champ? I went to get my just fortune un- unfolding told. Unfolding something at some little piece of paper. The spooky cat. Oh, <laughs> it's called the spooky cat. It's called the spooky the cat. Spooky the cat. That's adorable. Let me take a picture. Uh, yeah, it's a um, it's a little oh, like God, fortune teller me. card with a black kitten uh, with paws up Got on it. a crystal ball. Now he prefers African American. 
<laughs> Spooky the cat. Can we do it again? <laughs> I'm sorry. We, I like moved. We can also you're do the, it later. You're in the shop I don't want to be in the phone. Okay, we, we can also do it later. No. Already Steph started. There we go. Now. Okay. <laughs> um, so Spooky the cat tells me the future. Concerning your horoscope, the stars were out late last night and kind of slept in this morning. So they weren't really ready for, you know, the day. They called in sick. Check back tomorrow. <laughs> Fuck Spooky the Cat. <laughs> Two things. Uh, Spook- this is now yours. Spooky the Cat <laughs> is super rad. And also, now I got to try and get Spooky the Cat Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> I got to see if that's available. Um, also, Spooky uh, as a name oh, for a black it weird. cat. Yeah, he did spell it weird. <laughs> He spelled it like a rich white girl in L.A. S P O O K I E. Oh wow! Wow. Yeah. At edgeoftheworldart.com. <laughs> so where'd you get this? At Knott's Berry Farm. Oh, okay. Just off the floor? <laughs> no, I I paid a quarter. Oh, okay, from oh, a machine. It thing. was in like a thing. Oh, okay, from oh. a yeah, a little yeah. quarter machine. Okay. okay, so did anyone have a chance to look at the Boysenberry Festival tasting card that I posted on Instagram? Uh, no, I'm not on Instagram. Part much. of it, I think. Y'all need to get off Twitter and get back on Instagram. It's so much interesting. I need to get my Instagram back. He can't get his Instagram back. Just start a new one. I don't want to. It's so much easier. Unified branding, Barry. (laughs) Unified branding, boys and Barry. Right? That was was a Jordan joke. (laughs) What are you filming? Oh, nothing. I was just going to go to your thing on Instagram. Well, anyway, okay. So I, I, okay. So what it is is you buy a tasting card for thirty five dollars, and you get. Eight things out of the millions that they okay. have. So you can walk around, and they got booths everywhere. How Only many are waffles? Or waffle they adjacent? Had, they had a waffle. Mm. I did not get the waffle because this is part of the journey. Okay. I'm off all sugar. <laughs> Yay. Oof, boy. Welcome to my world. Yeah. Well, you're off all sugar because you can't afford sugar. Oh, off all sugar. Oh. What did you think I said? All full of sugar? Oh, no, no. <laughs> off. Oh, like, you're off sugar. I'm sugars. trying to better myself by uh, not having yeah, sugar. Yeah, no, I have to take sugar because it's a cheaper alternative to real food. Yes, I know. We have yeah. a lot of sugar on the table right now. Yes. Oh, we are this is the food. only weekend that I'm indulging <laughs> um, because Boysenberry Festival yeah. and I had yogurt today. So um <laughs> they had like... Yeah, so there was a, a, a waffle option. I did mm. not go for the waffle. I tried to stay as good as I could at sure. a sugar festival. The only two things I actually ate that would be had with sugar was I had a Oreo cookie dipped in oh. a boysenberry. I don't know what glaze? it was. Glaze, think, think glaze, Dip? like yeah. a, it, but it was like hard. Okay. So uh-huh. like, kind of like the fudge dipped Oreo cookies you yeah. get at Christmas, but imagine it to be blueberry and, or oh, boysenberry okay. instead. Okay. Um, that could have been the greatest goddamn cookie I've ever had in my life. Yeah, that yeah. sounds that sounds fucking wonderful. Fun. There, and, and when you bit into it, the Oreo was moist, oh. so it was fresh. Like Ooh. like Judith made it that morning. <laughs> Good that job, was her name. Judith. Fresh me, me and Judith, we hooked up. We talked. Um, so then. There was this other cookie that I did not, I bought it, but I didn't buy it. I didn't eat it until I got home. Yeah, I saw that picture. Ooh, so what is that? Lord. It oh, looks like a pie. It, it's a Y'all, blue, it's a boysenberry pie cookie. Check out, Ooh. uh, Leland P13 on Instagram. Also, just as moist as the other cookie. Like, yeah. I don't know how they kept their cookies moist. Um, so, of course I had the blueberry uh slurpee because that I had. Ooh, yeah. I've had that. Why would one. I not? Yeah. That sounds good. Um yeah. so I had a dry rubbed boysenberry flank steak with potatoes with oh. a cream cheese blueberry sauce. I saw that. That looks That's, good. That, I mean, that looks really good. Get close. That sounds like a good thing I would want. That, in my that sounds face. bananas, but yeah. what how how was it? Um it was good. The chicken skewers with the blueberry or boysenberry anoli sauce was better. Mm. Oh, uh, okay. I found that I found that the the steak was a little dry. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, like, I want this in and around my mouth. Sweet and meat together, like it's a weird, don't, but it's so good. It, though. it works. It's, it's strange. barbecue it sauce. Works. What? It's yeah, no, and, that, and I bought. I, I, sweet, but more tangy. Yeah, I bought. That's like I, I bought the barbecue burgers. sauce. Yeah. Which are bomb. <laughs> that was the, that was the one thing I bought. I was like, barbecue yet? sauce. Yeah. Those um, are pretty good. So this fountain. Oh, 
Blueberry oh, I saw fondue. that. Boysenberry fountain of just oh, boysenberry whatever fondue. this is, this boysenberry jizz fountain. And what it is, is this little girl goes in the little, the little girl, this little woman goes in the back. She puts a cheese, cheesecake on a stick <laughs> and she just dipped it in on in there, oh. left it. Spun it twice and oh. pulled it out and slapped it on a plate and gave it to some kid. And I was like, that kid's diabetes just went through the roof. Oh my god. I did not have that because okay. it was not a part of my eight. I had would have to pay an extra eight dollars for that. And yeah. I was uh-huh. like, oh no, I'm good. Um these are the last two we had was a pooled chicken pooled chicken barbecue tostada mm-hmm. oh. and that is a mac and cheese habanero oh my god with boysenberry barbecue sauce on top wow how was, was that was it tostadas you guys were banging on uh, a couple weeks ago tostada. or is it tortas or oh i like me a torta i don't know i've never I had a torta so. one of those things y'all you, you you two were like you ain't this fancy quit trying to overcharge me for it oh yeah tostada tostada, tostada. Right. yeah anyway oh and, uh, sorry i forgot this one so this is a Pork roast with uh-huh. boysenberry sauce on top, oh and that's mashed potatoes. That purple con- thing in the back there, mm-hmm. that's Mush- mashed potatoes actually just made with boysenberry fruit in it, oh, and man. then they just mix it that together. That sounds fucking cool. That now, that delicious. did not work for me as much. Really? It, was, it was good. Don't get me wrong, but I did that didn't like blow my skirt up any. Yeah. Now, roommate Mike, though, could yeah. not stop talking about oh, you it. Mean, you mean Black Mike? <laughs> I don't call him Black Mike. Anymore. He's not black. Anymore. That's not my thing. Anymore. I, I never said he was called Black Mike. When <laughs> you, you told, hear someone you say, told me he was Black Mike. I told you that's what Scott calls it. When I tell if you were to talk to someone, you don't know them. And you they go, Oh, this is my friend a uh, Black Mike. Yeah. And Mike rolls up. We're gonna meet Black Mike. And he's, he's not gonna be black. at the party. Wouldn't you be like, Why are y'all calling him Black Mike? Yeah. Uh, actually, I feel like it'd be more I racist think... if he was black. <laughs> oh, I mean, true. you're yeah. not wrong. You're not wrong. Look, I don't refer to you as Black, black Jordan, Jordan. <laughs> because I don't see color. Um, I refer to him as African American Jordan. I, I just refer to him as my friend Jordan, <laughs> who is black, who is also black. I go my one black friend. Uh, <laughs> oh, there you go. That's fine. But I can say it because yeah. <laughs> I have a black friend. But. He wears nothing but black. I've never yeah. seen him in any other color. He's just metal. He's, yeah. just, he's just so kid. metal. And and my other roommate was like, oh, that's Black Mike. And I'm like, we have to stop calling him that. <laughs> and he's just like, but he, he's Black Mike. And that's it. Like, the argument is over. I have no legs to stand on. He's like, but he is Black just Mike. stares like, you in the eye and demands you follow this, <laughs> yeah, this like, semi-racist, sh- ridiculous. Right. And I just kind of go, or Mike. <laughs> to the point where I've had to – and how this came about was because I have another friend, Mike – Gay Mike. So it's like, which is also insulting. You are yeah, living in a sitcom. Him- <laughs> <laughs> so I just call yeah, them. These these are like credits. Yeah. On the, I, call, on the, on the I, end of I personally call them roommate Mike and don't give a fuck Mike. Yeah. But that's not how other people see it. <laughs> yeah. uh, so not Berry Farm during the day is really weird. They have animals. What? Really? They have a barn. Like a petting of, zoo? No, you can't pet them. But is, uh, is it the red barn? Yeah, that's my next question. It is the red barn <laughs> the area. The red barn? That makes yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. But that's I that's why the red barn is always there. Um, <laughs> it was so, it was so funny. Like, like, um, Scott was like, oh, do we need a map? I was like, yeah, I don't, I'm, this ain't Disneyland. Like, I don't yeah. know where the, things are at. Yeah. I said, I know things where they are at Halloween. Yeah. So if you tell me I need to go to the red barn, I know where that's at. What, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what, what does the, the Louisiana house look like in the day? Oh, it's not even there. Oh, that's just I thought that was a permanent lot. fixture. No, 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 no. That's oh, just, fuck uh, me. they actually have There's that all Louisiana closed house. off. It's like the, 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 the Bayou House. The Bayou House. Yeah. Oh, I think it was the Halloween. That wasn't there last year. That was replaced by the shipwreck yeah. one we really dug. The, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. No, that's all blocked off. They have it. It's all cardened off because mm. that's open. Nice. That's really good. That's just open. It's parking lot space day. back there, I guess, oh. throughout the year. Huh. Interesting. Um, but they did have the, uh, I want to say Shogun Warrior, but that's not right. <laughs> um, the Samurai House. Yeah. yeah, yeah that, yeah. because we took the train. Oh, Shadowlands. 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 Yeah. Yeah. We took the, you know, where you threw your phone. Yeah. Um, <laughs> hey. So, 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 that was Dark Ride where you threw your phone, wasn't it? No, no, no. no. It was Shadowlands. Oh, it was Shadowlands. Yeah. So we yeah. took oh, the. You need to calm down outside. We took the train um, because you actually can ride the train as a ride. Oh. Terrible. And, <laughs> and, and it's, it's like. Yeah, it's an hour late and it's. 
full it, beyond it, capacity. It took, it took 45 minutes for us to get on that ride, and it's a 10 minute train ride. <laughs> and there is nothing. It's not like Disneyland where the, you see, you get wished the past and see the Grand Canyon. Yeah. No. You get robbed. I mean, they have a stick up. Ah. Like they have two actors, they walk through each car asking for money and he gets stuck mm. up. But I was That's like, That's rad. In theory, yes. But when you see it, you're like, oh. Just nobody's heart is in it? No. <laughs> Did they, like, they, they don't have like seated actors, like planted actors no, inside to no. be like, oh, oh no, they no, steal no. from the train. No, nothing like that. That's the thing I always wanted for like uh, uh, during Halloween time. You know, you're just, yeah. just walking through one of these mazes yeah, and then someone in get, your group. Yeah, and someone gets pulled out and like stabbed in front yeah. of you. Like, oh my God. Put a pin in that. But, <laughs> oh God. Um, but they had Shadowlands is still up. Yeah. Oh. So in the back. So I was huh. like, oh, okay. No, I mean, you can't, it's, you don't know what it is, but we all yeah. knew what yeah, it was because yeah, yeah. we were like, you can oh, tell shit. By shape. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. oh, that's cool. Um, no, at the Warner Brothers Horror Experience, which will not be coming back this year, oh, sad man. to say because they didn't make a lot of money on they it. Killed a man. <laughs> they, they killed a man. Uh, at the Paranormal House, yeah. they sneak a person into your group. That's awesome. And when they open a closet and the monster comes out, they grab that person and whisk them away, and you never see that person again. <laughs> that I remember you uh, mentioned that. Scared the shit out of me because I was like, well, what else are you like? Who the fuck are you with? Like, yeah. you just, bitch, you just appeared out of nowhere. Yeah. So you just became got stuck a group in of six. Pocket. Yeah, and why, why are you dress funny? You know, so I mean, what's this harness for? Yeah, I was like, why are you looking crazy? Anyway, oh my god, he's dead. Um, I don't want your headshot. But we didn't ride any rides. Uh, it was super busy because it's Easter. You didn't weekend. ride the Jaguar. <sighs> you didn't um, ride the Ghost Rider. Like the flying. Fuck the Ghost Rider. <laughs> or that my back. Pony hurts. Express. Thing? No, I'm telling the lines were huge. Oh. It was it was um Easter weekend. All right, yeah. that, that, that makes sense. sense. I mean, yeah, even not got busy. <laughs> we were all shocked. all the overflow from uh, <laughs> Disney, Disney Universal. Universal yeah. Yeah. But it was kind of cool. Um the boysenberry stuff was amazing. I could have bought all of it, but there would have been no reason because it at would one have? No, but I mean at, at a certain point you just kind of go yeah, I, let me guess. That got boysenberry in it too. <laughs> yeah. Like you name was, it, they had it. Was there anything that you tasted that was not good? The boysenberry ketchup was not good. Oh, yikes! Okay. But the mustard was good. Huh? Double yikes. Um, the, I was told by Mike and Scott the relish was legit, but I don't fuck with no relish, so that's not happening. Oh, yeah, boysenberry not relish? Yeah. I would have tried it. Now Scott bought the boysenberry uh, mustard, like a take home jar, yeah. and I dipped my finger in it. Fine, like it would be good on something. Sure, maybe As mustard is no, like but I mean, sandwich? like you know, like you can taste certain things and you'd be like, yeah. oh, like like salsas. You, you're like, oh, that's a good salsa. That'll yeah. be really good on this. Yeah, like I tasted the mustard. I'm like, oh, on a turkey on rye, that'd probably be pretty good. But I'm not gonna have a turkey on rye, so I'm never gonna eat that again. So get it out of my face. <laughs> um, I'll, I bought some jerky, boysenberry infused jerky uh, for my boss. I haven't okay. tried it yet, but when he opens it tomorrow, I'm definitely getting down on it. Yeah. <laughs> and the um, I ha- I bought barbecue sauce because barbecue sauce. Sauce. why would you sauce. not? But they had chipotle salsa, relish, ketchup, oh. honey, syrup, tea. Apparently, this this genetically uh, created yeah. fruit is a universal yeah. ingredient. We didn't watch any of the shows, but I wanted to. That apparently, there was a show of the history of the boys and Bear, and I was like, <laughs> why aren't we going to that show? Because I want to know how you got a raspberry fucking a blueberry, and thus becoming the greatest berry. Bow, chicka, bow, bow. Uh, yeah, so it's pretty legit. And Now that I know what it is, I'm more likely to go again. Okay, I would like then. to know how they got to the name Boysenberry. Yeah. Those boys, they're in the berries. I think it's a blueberry raspberry combo. Yeah, but. Where do you get the, like, the boy sound? I, I, I don't know. Man. I, I, the, the boy I, prefix. I'm, I'm I mean, with the blackberries in there as well. Oh, it's all the berries. Uh, except strawberry. Mm, the redheaded stepchild. They, yeah. they got, like, a rhubarb in there? Redheaded stepberry. Is that a berry? I don't think so. And that's more like a, a root, I thought. I, I kind of have no idea. I I've, just know it's the I, poor man's strawberry. I've never it's, heard. I don't it, know what a rhubarb is. It's good when you put it with a strawberry, though, in a yogurt. Hmm. Well, I've yeah, had it, it in something. Yeah. Did Rhubar- rhubarb pie. Did you get the rhubarb pie at the uh, 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 chicken pot pie shop? Chicken pot, chicken I don't chicken think pot so. pie. I don't think so. I remember I saw it there. I think you, I thought you got that. I don't know. Uh, um, I usually go now. apple. Did anybody see Pet Cemetery? No. No. You're all good. 
I, I really? Feel, really? I feel like you see the entire movie in the trailer. You do. Well, in the oh. second trailer. Yeah. No, um, if you were to look up the word mediocre, yeah, there'd be a picture uh, of Pet Cemetery. I'm not surprised. Yeah. That was the it guy, right? Yeah, he, which was well, the producers of oh producers, yeah, okay. not the directors. Right. Also, it was yeah. a movie starring Jason Clark, so and he's fine. No, that's it. He's fine. Name one good movie he's been in. I can't, but he's fine. <laughs> but um, you can't name any bad movie movies either. Like they're all just. I think fine. the movie did what I think is actually a worse offense than being a bad movie. Is you made a boring movie. Uh, is it boring? It's kind of boring. It's not very scary. Like I actually, really? I mean, I jumped at one point, but. Mostly due to the woman next to me jumped louder than I did, and I was more <laughs> no. surprised by that. Uh, what was, uh, the, the mom's sister still? Yeah, creepy? she's in there, but like, the man that played her in the original is so much more scarier than mm. this prosthetic up woman. See, mm. I've never seen the first one. It's not good either. Oh man. I, I okay. just don't think this, everyone claims this is like Stephen King's scariest novel, and it's so good, and I'm like, yeah, the novel's probably great, but the movies are not. Is how how much of this movie is repeated from the first one? Oh, it's a completely departure. Okay. Yeah, I mean, they well, even, at, le- at least that's no, something. I, yeah, they. I mean, it's different. It's got a lot of the same beats, but yeah. it is well, drastically different. Still based on the mm. same story, but yeah, yeah. it wasn't no it. I, mm, okay. Um, I thought Us was more terrifying, and I didn't consider Us a horror movie at all. No, it's it's yeah, a, it's it's a, a thriller. suspense thriller yeah. at best. Yeah. And even though I and I liked Us a lot, and I thought well, I would watch Lupita Nyong'o sleep. Like that woman is so good at everything yeah, she, she does. She's yeah. Great. I was like, oh, I don't give a fuck what this movie's about. I'm watching you for the next two hours. Well, be she's, amazing. she's first giving that uh, the 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 tethered. Like speech, she first starts talking. Oh, oh yeah, all of that so fucking I mean, I, amazing. I, 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 that's fantastic. Yeah. Um, my when I left the theater is when I started to have problems with the movie because yeah. I started thinking, and I started falling into the like. There's questions you shouldn't ask about a movie like that. Jordan's yeah. got a good video for you to and, watch, and I was just kind of watching yeah. it, and I was just like, then how did they eat? The, the like, rabbits. Oh, right, I understand that, but I was just like. Where do you get their clothes? Yeah, no, we asked those and, questions. And that's yeah. where my problem is. I was just kind of like, so if I'm taking a shit, are they taking a shit too? Like, if I mean, I'm fucking, are they fucking? Like, it was, yeah. it was, yeah. it was stuff like that that I started wondering. And then it was oh, like, no, yeah, if, if you start, I got really, I got caught yeah. in the minutia and then yeah. I, I actually, I'm having a trouble pulling myself out. Yeah. yeah if, if you start kind of going into that, um, like there's, there's a video that I'll probably never see the light of day. <laughs> uh, <laughs> where, still on Steph's computer. Uh, where, where we oh, were talking about it. Man. We recorded. Uh, yeah. yeah, and yeah, there's a lot of weird shit that it implies by sheer virtue of like sure. saying yeah. they're this soulless other that is living a similar life down below that was created by the government for no reason. And like, it was just weird. Like, we saw their bedrooms and they're all like bunk beds. Yeah. But I don't sleep in a bunk bed. Yeah. 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 Uh, anyway, it, it, but that's like, not like what the movie's about. Like, no. I completely <laughs> understand that, yeah. but I just, I got caught in this thing, what, and I'm having... What do you think the movie's about? Oh, I couldn't tell you. Okay. <laughs> uh, no, Jordan I, has a good video for I you. I have a very good video for right you. Right on. I mean, yeah. it, it, I mean, it, like, clearly when you watch Get Out, you know what they're trying to yeah. tell you yeah, there, yeah, yeah, and yeah. I felt this one's a little more out there. Um, have anyone watched his Twilight Zone? I, I saw the first I episode. I watched the first episode. episode. Yeah. I like it. I don't love it. It's, it's honestly, it doesn't it's get It's not the better. strongest first episode by it's far. It's not the strongest second either. Oh, yeah? Really? Yeah. No, I didn't watch the second one. That's I've heard. It's the, um, the airplane one, right? Yeah. yeah. I haven't seen that one. It's fine. That's not just a repeat of no, the last. No, no, no. Okay. Same title, but different. Okay. Well, yeah, so slightly the same title, different thing altogether. Okay, cool. Yeah. I mean, it was, it's a good, like, everyone's well acted. Yeah. It's shot great. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's just, you I watch it, it's like. Steven Yoon. That was last week's. Yeah. Oh. I haven't watched that one yet. I want to watch that. Oh, he, he looks so fucking pimp in like this weird like 40s suit. Zoot, zoot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No. That dude, <laughs> well, remember I met him? Dude is so good looking in person. Yeah. yeah. Like, he, he was one of those just like. Glenn from The Walking Dead. Yeah. It was yeah. one of those where I was like, damn. I was like, <laughs> he looks not like a good looking dude. Would you not, I'd you know, hold me. he's got shit Covered all over you. Guys, <laughs> yeah. was like, was just like, what's up, brother? Yeah. Um, it, it was, uh, yeah, it was interesting. Um, yeah. Y'all see anything else? 
Shazam. Shazam was great. I, I had a lot of fun. I just saw uh, Shazam this weekend. I cried my eyes out. My, my, my oh, biggest, me too. My biggest gripe with Shazam is I wish they did not show the uh, the rooftop scene in the trailer. Where he jumps off the roof. Oh right! I, I yeah. wish yeah. I wish I saw that first in the theater. That yeah, is it's such I, a I see where you're going with scene. that. But you get why they showed it in the trailer because oh, yeah, yeah. it's a cool shot. Yeah, yeah. and um, they kind of need. I I feel they still needed everything they could mm-hmm. to get you to see Shazam. Yeah, but, but remember when we were walking around WonderCon and we saw the action figures. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh, why? I remember I was going on, I'm like, why do they make action figures for shit? We know it's not going to be in the movie. Like, Batman ain't going to get on a slow sled yeah, and slide. Yeah. Like, why do you make that shit? <laughs> no. Then fuck me. They made those figures because they're in the fucking movie. Yeah. And that blew my mind. It was like, when they all grabbed the staff, that was, I was like, great dude, review. I hit Scott. I was like, shut the fuck up. Yeah. yeah. He was like, what is about to happen? I was just like, I don't know yet. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm excited. <laughs> Because I think what's going to happen is going to happen. And then, like, you everyone see the, say my name. Oh, Billy. that was the best part. <laughs> that was good. Um, and when they, like, drop the, uh, the crutch. Yeah. And then I, I was like, oh my God. And I'm crying. And then I get, I get pulled immediately out because I was like, Adam Brody? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I went, DJ Contra? I'm yeah. Like, what? Making good. Sure. I mean, people got to have these, th- yeah. you know, people need to work. Yeah. Um, <laughs> actors come from somewhere. Sure. Uh, but I didn't, I, but I, I'd ask Matt, 21 year old Matt, because mm-hmm. apparently, a Shazam aficionado. Oh. Who knew they were out there? <laughs> okay. And I had to ask him many questions. I manage a comic book shop. A legit comic book shop. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, it's not no, a comic book shop. No, no, no. <laughs> what, what I'm saying is just like, because you do doesn't mean you know all. And Shazam... Sh- thank for you the for most saying part, that. Could you explain that to a lot of my customers? Shazam, <laughs> for the most part... Also, you don't have to. Uh, Shazam, oh, for the I most do. part, is still like a third-tier character. Yeah. Like, he yeah. was around for the... 52 reboot, but his books never took off. No, it's because they're awful. Yeah. In, in the new one, I don't like either, but... Yeah. Um, and he was nowhere in the last one. The last time Shazam really had, like, a moment of note is Kingdom Come. Wow. Really? Yeah? It, yeah. It's, you I mean, is there, you is, there, is there any other... All right, Leland? I, I would still like to read it, though. It's great. Oh, it's great. No, yeah, it's yeah, a great yeah, yeah. It's amazing. A hundred percent. I think I have it. I don't know. I need um, to finish Umbrella Academy first. Bitch... What? I lent that to you weeks ago. I know. It's a slog. No, it's not. I don't like the first. Oh, you suck. I read it. I recently reread it again. I was like, yeah, show's better. I I think it's super fun. I think (laughs) it's real kinetic. I was like, show's better. They, 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 you're, the book, my problem with the book is you're, you're, it's only six issues. Yeah. So everything happens real quick. Yeah. And you don't get a lot of character development on those. So when you watch the show and you're like, oh, damn. Y'all improved on this story. They're, they're both good. They're both they're, good. They're I both agree fantastic. with you, but I like the show better. Um, you watched Doom Patrol yet? Yeah, I actually. Fuck yes. Have you watched uh, any of the Doom Patrol that I gave you? No, because Steph still has the USB. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, that I didn't give it to you. is she didn't give it to me. amazing. How great is Wash? Fuck that. How great is The Mummy? Like, <laughs> who the fuck remembered Brendan Fraser was that good? About halfway through that movie, I was like, oh, that's right. You were like an A-list really celebrity solid. at one point. Yeah. You are like so you good the this. jungle. He's still distracting <laughs> to look at when he's like, oh, it's because he got Brendan fat. Fraser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he got old. I mean, it happens to everybody. We shouldn't judge him on no, that. No, yeah. no, but, but it's very about distracting. It, I, I feel <laughs> well, how I feel about it is it's like an uncanny valley. Something about my brain tells me this isn't right. Yeah. Like it, it's not actually how he looks. Well, enjoy yeah. it now because it, you know. We'll see how that app goes. Oh, you think it's going to? Yes. Maybe by actually Christmas. Really? Surprisingly, maybe around November. Ooh. Mm. I mean. Yeah. Well, no, that app started with a lot of problems. <laughs> it did. It yeah. did. And it, it didn't have enough to launch with. You got two shows. And mm. apparently they're cycling shit in and out even though you don't have enough. Yeah. What is this? Is the, I don't understand the cloud and stuff like yeah. that yeah. well i'm under the impression it's infinite right i mean if it's, it's only as much have... as you physically have in your in your sure but i warehouse. mean warehouse i could stare at netflix for hours yeah, yeah. well they've got more money uh, is, but is it is it just money like yeah. is that how you get space yeah yeah, yeah. so because, is that why they take Leland. away the superman movies when you're like you only Leland. have four it's <laughs> not actually in the cloud I don't care where it is. It's on it's, servers. It's it's in a computer somewhere else that you can just access from anywhere. Well, I'm just saying it's ridiculous to launch it a, an app when you have 
only two shows. And and to mm-hmm. charge ten bucks? Seven ninety nine. Seven ninety nine. Yeah. Ooh. Um mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. For, that's, that's, that's why Disney's like six ninety nine, and yeah. not only six ninety nine, <laughs> but they're launching with two so, movies and like eight shows. Oh, and all the Disney movies and the National Geographic. There's so much and stuff like on fo- it. 20th Century Fox shit. Yeah, that's not been announced yet, but we all know it'll be. Well, on they said there the tw- uh, they yeah. said Simpsons is in it. Sure, but yeah. like my, my point is, is when I got to the end of that announcement, I was trying to shove seventy dollars through my laptop. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, can I just give it to you now? Please, yeah. I want it so badly. But, <laughs> But did, or, uh, Warner Brothers, though, they had a boomy. Yeah. Six months. Then I was like, yeah, I guess I'll, I'll fork it over because I want to see how bad this is. You I know, mean, like, Titan, Titans was not strong enough to ooh, really get buzz. No. Doom Patrol is good. Uh, I realized... Young Justice was great, but then they took a hiatus. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I keep forgetting I have to find that. Please. Um, I want to watch it so bad. Okay. Um, and then I got excited because I saw somewhere like, oh, that's right, Swamp Thing is coming soon. And then immediately after, I'm like, oh yeah, Swamp Thing is on immediate uh, hiatus, uh, possibly indefinitely. Oh no, they just cut its th- last three remaining episodes. Yeah. Like, oh. No, I, strangely, this is the Some, ir- something with the creators of the show, like they they walked. Sure. Um, so <laughs> what happened at the store last week Ooh, is what happened. What happened was is I was because uh, like I was told you before, people come in and just talk. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, and and you're in the center of oh, um, I'm the ear to the motherfucking ground. I'm yeah. Like, I'm like, what's that? <laughs> you you live on the pulse. Oh, yeah, fly on the wall. I can tell you who dies in game. That's how much oh, is said Jesus. in my store. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Stop it. you say that, but I'm gonna I'm gonna call you like Friday morning, and we're gonna compare notes. Oh um, well, how about Saturday morning? Because I'm seeing it on Friday. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, <laughs> we're seeing it Saturday at nine. I'm gonna morning. watch it twice. Oh, I'm going on Monday again. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> but what I witnessed is I had a guy come in and be like, yeah, he goes, you see the Swamp Thing tra- teaser? And I was just like, oh, no, I'm, you know, working. Uh, and then they were like, oh, yeah, yeah. And then like two minutes later, a guy comes in uh, and he was like, he hooked up with the other guy. And they were like, yeah, so uh insert name. Well, they just got the high on uh, their last three episodes were canceled. He goes, but they just released the teaser. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay and he goes well did you get that other memo about the app going away yeah i got that memo uh, and he goes oh. yeah so maybe i there's nothing confirmed or right now or you know allegedly everything i'm saying yeah no, no one who's listening is kidding um is the, the the comic book end of that is that just essentially the marvel unlimited for dc pretty much i, mean, I don't want to read a comic book on my computer I mean, but if the app is good and if, if they're if they're transferring it to panel to panel, I can then... tell you also where they lost money. It's not on consoles. It's, oh yeah, yeah. It's not on Xbox I, or PS4. I think I heard Why it, the yeah. fuck aren't you on a console? I think yeah. I heard that it, it's about to hit Xbox. Great, an Xbox, another piece of shit thing on an Xbox that doesn't work. Cool. God damn, they can't do anything right. Over I mean, there. they're coming out with the all digital edition, the Xbox. One X all digital. The X bone said. Is this, is, is, is the menu the same confusion? Yeah, yeah it is. Then fuck it. It just I never know where the games are, <laughs> where my apps are, nothing. It's so not user friendly, just like a Microsoft thing. It's just awful. <laughs> I know, but you got it because it was the only one offered to you. It wasn't like you chose the Xbox. <laughs> There's literally a PS4 that you could be using right there. Y'all can fuck off. But it, it just frustrated me. I was just, and then they asked Jim Lee at like the first panel, they were like, is it going to be on console? And he goes, it'll be wherever I, our fans want it. Yeah. How about you uh, stop dodging the question and actually answer? Is it on a fucking console? <laughs> I mean, where most people it watch will their be. Shit now. Yeah. Like if it's it's not even on like Apple TV as far as I oh, know. Wow. wow. I don't know that for a fact it could be I don't have an Apple TV. <laughs> wow. So if you I have mean, an Apple TV, fuck off. Like but. Re- realistically, <laughs> like you're you're right though. You're right though. Like if you're gonna release a streaming app, then the video content at the very least, like the comic books and, and the in the web store didn't have to be, but the the streaming video at the very least has to be everywhere you're streaming video. Yeah. Everywhere. Everywhere. So no. the consoles and like the Roku would be sure. great too, but and I know it's second on tier, that. but is it on Apple TV? It's on iOS, Android, Roku, Apple TV, Android TV, and Amazon Fire TV. Oh, cool. So everything but a, but console. a console. Yeah. Okay. I mean, and kids, 
mostly watch stuff. Yeah, on no, I, I still, yeah. I still agree. It's yeah. it's real important to be on Xbox, which and is why I'm. I mean, they, but you're not, you're not nowhere. Yeah. No, you're not. No, I'm not saying that. But yeah. and, and and you know, and the thing about it is, like, maybe I don't know. Disney hasn't announced if they're on a console. They got the money, but you know I, they're going to be on a console. I assume they like, they they poured all the money into this. I mean, it's just like Jesus Christ. I mean, they're they're they're, they're pulling from Netflix and shit. And yeah, it's just a shame that <laughs> Warner Brothers just keeps making mistakes, poor decisions <laughs> after decisions, yeah. and they don't learn from their mistakes. Yeah. They just keep making all new ones, and you're just like, <laughs> guys, because it, it get feels your shit together. It feels like everything they do is completely. Based off of the ledger and what what money they think there is, yeah. And no one is thinking with their heart. Like not a single person is making like a gut decision. And you know the funny thing about Shazam, not, it's under the Warner Branner, banner, yeah, made it's by a, New Line, made by New Line. Yeah. And I was kind of maybe y'all should just give all your stuff to New Line. Sure. Because mm-hmm. clearly someone over there understood what this movie needed to be. Yeah, they knew what they were doing. I mean, I I, I think. A easy answer has been staring in the face for like the last seven years mm. and just let fucking Greg Berlanti take over, fuse the, the yeah. television and movies together. Like the television vibe is great. I mean, I, seven years ago, I would have said give it to Jeff Johns, but apparently rumor around the campfire burned too many bridges. Mm. That's like he, he, Angela Bassett waiting to exhale, walked off her way from that car. Like he burned down his building. And I was like, <laughs> all right, all right, I'm, I'm just going to take that. Reference. She uh, knew what I was on, talking on, about. As, as said. No, she didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just took Angela Bassett. <laughs> I know who Angela I got Bassett that, is. And then, and then, and then. Shut up. This is a good reference if y'all yeah. got it. Okay. <laughs> um, it's just a shame. Like, um, I had a guy who's working on, uh, the, he worked on the Birds of Prey movie. Yeah. And he did lighting. And I'm like, oh, how was that? He goes, well, the lighting is great. <laughs> <laughs> As soon as, as soon as they released the name <laughs> yeah. of that movie, I'm like, dumpster fire. Yeah. yeah. Um, they, again, they're not learning. They make, it's their Deadpool. Hard R, mm. F bombs every five minutes. Yeah, you've, you've and you're like, that before. so a little girl wearing a Harley outfit can't get in. Yeah. There, you sure, you just lost a bunch of money. Yep. I'm sure someone will say that eventually along the path to this being released and then it'll be taken down when, to PG-13. When yeah. they release the PG-13 version at yeah. Christmas. Yeah. So it's just kind of like, <laughs> mm. um, and then I had a guy who worked on the Joker and he said, he goes, yeah, that's, that's a thing that happens. Alex, Alex Bananas. I'm, I, I don't, what did we say at Comic? You don't, I don't want to humanize the Joker. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't want to sympathize with the, with the I'm Joker. Like, also, don't need an origin story. No, I'm so over it. <laughs> I don't give a shit that it's like looks like taxi driver. I don't give a fuck. We have a taxi driver. It, uh, like, mm. We're fine. And and he looks so terrible. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean Joaquin, not the Joker. Like, so. <laughs> he is uncomfortable to look at when they show like him without a shirt and he's oh. so like yeah. malnutritioned. And just like gaunt. Mm-hmm. The, the, this is Joaquin Phoenix's uh, the machinist. You know, he just I mean, wants to be Christian Bale. Oh, you're probably not wrong. <laughs> it's I. I do. He's, I think he's gone fat to thin. <laughs> I do kind of feel bad for Jared Leto on one hand. Like he was promised yeah. and signed on to do these things, and they were like, "Oh, no one liked your Joker. Maybe it was at the concept, and maybe not the actor. No, yeah. it was yeah. not the actor. It, it was the like, like, concept. Yeah. Like." On paper, yes, he is the Joker. I mean, I would have given him, yeah, he's skinny, he's talented, mm-hmm. he's all teeth when he he's, smiles, yeah. he's the Joker. He has a, he's easily, mm. uh, has a menacing face to yeah. him. It's, and I think even if you took away the image, like if you just read the script, it'd still probably look pretty good. Maybe. Um, but if you stripped away that like, Flashy, like fucking, like uh, uh mumblecore rapper look to him. <laughs> <laughs> like you, Gross. you. There was something there. There was sure. something you, you, you could have done. Definitely doing stuff. Yeah, it's unfortunate he's barely in that movie. I, he's, I mean, yeah. he's unnecessary in that movie altogether. Yeah. Well, why they didn't make him the main villain, I'll never understand. Yeah, I, it's just yeah, yeah. That was the no biggest one, mistake. No one knows what an enchantress is. And no one still knows. No, yeah, and I don't like that chick. You guys were kind of praising her, but not praising her a couple Here's weeks ago. We were talking about her eyebrows. She's awful. No, like, I just, just can't her stand eyebrows. her Yeah, we were eyebrows. talking about her brows. Yeah. They're so thick. She she did RuPaul a couple weeks ago, and I was like, bitch, don't talk. 
<laughs> she weird. She's weird. She is a weird one. Well, you know her her reputation is I'm the bratty model, and she's like she wears it as like a badge. Mm, and I'm no. like I'm like she don't don't be a, a you, bitch. You should Michelle yeah. Rodriguez. I think I forgot if I was reading that before. They what now? She, I think maybe I'm wrong. Like she's friends I with. I think they no, were dating. No, I think they were dating, and then I thought she was with Ashley Benson. Who's was Ashley, that it? Who's Ashley Benson? She's in Pretty Little Liars. Oh, she's. Why are you yelling? <laughs> sorry, she's the the girl that doesn't talk in pixels. The red, the girl you, in the you dress. You are the impression I remember anything from pixels. She's the one. R- she was the trophy. Tr- remember the trophy that girl turned at the into end, fucking that, that Hubert. Hubert turned into. Oh. That yeah. weird thing? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's Yeah, yeah, she's dating that. Ashley Benson. Oh, I, th- that, I think we saw it together okay. in the theater. We did not. I'm pretty sure that was yeah, still we were both right. I, I know for sure. I know 100% I have not seen that movie. I'm going to say that's not I true. swear I, I thought, you, thought you guys have. Though. I have not seen it. Maybe I, I, I know, you're, I know, you're, you're better off I not know because for a movie. fact I have not seen and it. And I know for a fact I would not have gone to a free press you, screening without you. You went with somebody, but it wasn't me. I don't think that's true, but we'll move on. Uh yeah, so, um, anything else? You, are, are you all caught up? I, mean, I guess you, I'm caught up. I feel like I've really talked a lot and that was not my goal. I just wanted to hang out with you guys. We talked together for a, a while. Did we? Plus, I mean, you led the conversation. What? You're making up for lost time. I know, but the people who don't know me or who are listening are like, why are you giving this guy a lot of time? <laughs> oh my god, time? you're like, fine. Just... So yesterday, I, 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 I got, I got back, uh, from my parents' house. I was bring, I was bringing stuff over to my apartment and I see in the street somebody Dropped their ID. Oh, okay. <laughs> you said you had an ID story. <laughs> like, like a driver's license? Yes. Okay. So when I first saw this, it was a black dude. I was like, oh shit, did I drop my ID? <laughs> That's fair. Oh no, but I wait, picked it up. Wait. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna. Keep no, going. no, please, please, I wanna hear this. <laughs> <laughs> did you think it was you because all black people look alike? I mean, <laughs> no, here, I'll, I'll, I'll show you why I okay. thought it was me for, for a, a hot second. Um, so here is a picture of the ID. Cause I took a picture cause I was, yeah. So that, there's a picture of the ID. Okay. Right? I want to grab that really quick. I, I just, you want to hold it? He's, at, he's oh, asking you to? Sorry, I didn't understand what you wanted. So I took a, took a good look at that picture. Wasn't this guy on SNL? <laughs> <laughs> and then look at, this one. I so walking up to it, I was like, "Oh yeah, is no, that... that's you. This is your ID. <laughs> if, if your you... name is now Kyle." <laughs> <laughs> if you glance at it, but he has a, like no, a thin head. Yeah, because it was, it was far away at first. I was like, is that my ID? Is... Oh no, it's not I, my ID. Yeah, all right, I, yeah. I can see it. You both have like the same smile. So I I, I pick it up. And I'm like, "Oh man, Kyle, you dropped your ID, brother. You're, uh, you're dead somewhere now." <laughs> yeah, that, that's the thing. I was like, "Man, if I ever drop my ID." I'd be fucking like I'd be losing my mind because black man had no ID. Mm-mm. Uh, the, on on the podcast that came out today that you haven't gotten to listen to, mm. uh, Jordan um, brings back up the my my weekend where I almost went out without my wallet, without my ID. Right, how you would have been completely fine. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and I mean, long story short, Fuck this guy. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> long story short, it Jordan finally gets to like his point of that. He could not go anywhere without an ID. No, not at all. Yeah. Because I have white privilege and it's, I, nothing bad would really happen a to me. A friend of mine lost his ID for yeah. a good nine months. Yeah. Driving around this car, nine months, no driver's license. Yeah. White he guy. Get, he, yes, yeah, white guy. He gets stopped by the police. License registration. Oh, I'm sorry, officer. I lost my ID card. You know what the officer said? Ha! <laughs> you take it easy, son. Be safe. And let him go. <laughs> He messaged just immediately after and said, wow, I have it so easy, guys. I'm so sorry. And he apologized to Jordan. And then he said, I won't have it. I wouldn't have it any other way. (laughs) Let's just see. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot to unpack there. And and you're not wrong. (laughs) But until you really got to the point of why you were so obsessed with with my casual not having a, a, a any identification on me. Uh, until you got to the point, I just did not understand. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I'm like, why? Why are you so that, upset that, about that's this? That's a house party I can't attend. Um, <laughs> so I look I'll at, almost steal that. <laughs> <laughs> so I look, I look at the the address on it. It's a, oh, yeah. Spring Valley. That's like 15 minutes away from me. Okay. 
I could put it in the mail and they'll send it over to his house. Yeah. Or you about, could just drive there. Yeah. So I'm thinking, well, it's a Sunday. Mail is not going to be picked up until Monday. It'd be a week till he gets it. He could be dead by then. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So I'm like, I wouldn't want to, because he probably has to drive around. It's his driver's license. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm going to save this dude's life. I'm just going to go drive to his place, give him his ID. It'd be all cool. So I drive over to Spring Valley. <laughs> I park at this market because there's like no place to park where that house is. Okay. And I'm just asking everybody else. He's like, hey, do you know oh. this guy? Do you, does he live down the street or whatever? Guy at the market's like, you know where he lives. I recognize this dude. I've seen him often, but not for a while. I'm like, okay, cool. <laughs> so his house is down there, right? He's like, yeah, it's over there. So I go up and it's, I'm in Spring Valley. Okay. And it's the most country ass looking road I've ever seen in my life. I'm like, thank God it's daylight right now. So for, for just everyone else, uh, outside of San Diego, Spring Valley is not a great neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll just I'll just leave it at that. Yeah, I'm gonna show you yeah. guys a picture of what <laughs> you took a picture of, like just the you, of like you, you took a picture and like immediately like sent it to Steph. He's like Steph, this is where I am. Uh, uh, just just so <laughs> you're, no, you're not wrong. <laughs> if you don't hear from me in 15 minutes, just uh, the, my will is under my bed. Yeah, no, I, I did my usual thing where I said I told everyone possible like, hey. This is what I'm doing. You post it on Facebook. If I go missing, here's the first clue. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, that's what the road looks like. That's what the road looks like. Oh shit, I, I remember seeing that in Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> exactly. Uh, so then I, I, I walk down the street, I'm like, What you want, boy? I, I find the house. Yeah. Okay. I walk up to the house. I call Steph. Steph is on the phone with me. Cause I'm like, okay. Should I just go up to this house right now? <laughs> so I'm walking up. I'm I almost would. at the door. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I was waiting for like a scuffle because it was just like, oh, are you? And then I was like, he's, the phone's not next to him right now. <laughs> yeah. So, and then I just hear talking. Yeah. And yeah. I was so like, so, so hmm. I'm walking up to the door and I'm like, I'm about to go. And then I see this dude crouched down by a car. What? Okay. <laughs> like, wait, like in a, like an attack position? No, no, no. Oh, okay. like you got to work phrasing. <laughs> <laughs> I got scared for you for a moment. I, I did that on purpose. He's alive. <laughs> He's right here. No shit. Oh, or am I? Whoa. <laughs> Just fade away. Wait, we Steph, haven't. You're still high. No, I'm it's not. last night. No, I'm not. <laughs> Wait, we haven't seen Jordan for up to 25 years. Jesus Christ. Uh, so this dude. We're still doing the ghost podcast. Yes. <laughs> God, and this is hell. Ghost. So, so this dude, he's staying by his car. He's apparently working on, working on it. Yeah. He looks at me really confused. I'm like, hi, sir. It's a white guy. Hi, sir. <laughs> Do you know this guy? <laughs> he looks at that and he's like, I have no idea who that is. I'm like, okay, it's weird. Cause your address is on his ID. Mm-hmm. He's like, oh my gosh, you're right. He must not have lived here for a very long time. <laughs> <laughs> he is a ghost. <laughs> so, uh, is this get out? <laughs> I was like, <laughs> no, this has been a trap the whole, the whole time. time. Yeah. <laughs> Someone left this ID yeah. for another black man to pick up yeah. and j- just follow the breadcrumbs. I was honestly waiting for him to, why don't you come inside for a second? I was like, Jordan, no, Jordan, no, no. blink twice if you're in there. <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> just never like, blink. Why don't you come on in for some sweet tea, son? Yeah, I'm uh, good. Yeah, I saw you. this movie. Yeah. Yeah, but but he was really helpful. He was like, sure. Oh, you know, uh, maybe just go down the street. To ask the dude with all the trucks, maybe he'll know. I'm like, all right, cool, I'll go do that. I didn't do that. No, uh, <laughs> you've done enough already. I'll be honest. Yeah, with no. You. At that point, I was like, you know what? Sorry, Kyle. Kyle. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I tried. So I went back to my neighborhood, and I and I put the ID just on on the mailbox because I'm like, you don't know. The, sure, you don't maybe, know maybe he lives in your neighborhood. Yeah, yeah. maybe you're in the neighborhood. Maybe one of your homies is going to be in the neighborhood. Maybe they'll find your ID. Yeah. Uh, I came back home today. ID's gone. So someone may have, may, might have mailed it. Maybe Kyle got it. I don't know. Uh, sorry, Kyle. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I I applaud that you you went above and beyond for you know your community and all that good shit. <laughs> um, I, when you said mail it, like my first, I was like, oh, would I have mailed it? No, I would have just left it on the ground. You piece of shit. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> because I would have been like, that sucks for you. <laughs> Yeah, but my thought process would not have been mm-hmm. racially charged or, no. as you put it, like, oh, I never thought about the reasoning you just said. Yeah. I will now. <laughs> but, like, my thought was, like, I don't have time for that. I have my own problems. Yeah. <laughs> so to like, mail an ID. You can't spend, like, a 35 cents and just write I'm an address on an envelope. I said if I didn't. Yeah. Oh. Or maybe I didn't. But that was what I was implying. Like, okay. if one of the options. You're probably right. I would have probably Oh, well, it. one other thing. I went back to the market, like, before I left. I was like... 
All right, I'm thinking about two things. I could either leave it here with you, or I could just take it back to our neighborhood. You're the close, like this dude is the closest person yeah. you've gotten to Kyle. And then, and then the the dude at the market, he straight up says, "I'd throw it away. I'm sorry. Like, uh, <laughs> if I didn't do it, like my cousin who also works here will probably throw it away tomorrow. I'm like, all right, cool. Thank you for being honest. And I left. Like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I, I throw it away. I'm like, all right, cool. Thank you. <laughs> like. <laughs> I appreciate his honesty, but also that ID expires next month. So yeah, I looked. I tried finding him too. Yeah, I so. did a Google search. I, I was did. gonna say, like, did anyone try like, Facebook? I tried Facebook. And, yeah. I tried All Instagram. Right. I didn't find you. I mean, yeah. even, if, even if you had mailed it, it would have been given to that white dude. Yeah, and he, he would have been like, yeah. I don't know what this is. So, yeah, but you yeah. wouldn't have known it. But, but like, yeah. if you no, we would not first. have known that. And, yeah. that. and that's that's why I told the white dude like, hey, so. If this shows up in your mail, like at least you have some context of what's happening. Yeah, <laughs> like, true. Like someone so, else could find it. Yeah. Someone's not sending in. a ransom lo- uh, note. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I have Kyle. Great. I don't know Kyle. who's Kyle. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, Kyle. Yeah. yeah. But I, I felt fairly confident I wasn't gonna die because it was still daylight and I could run fast. So. <laughs> <laughs> so how long did your trip go yesterday? Oh, to get there? Yeah. I mean, did you did it take as long as for for your new brows for the four hour conversation I had listened to about it? <laughs> oh I yeah, mean, you it, all are detour motherfuckers it, and stories. So much shit being said that don't. Be, it was Sunday afternoon <laughs> and the and the sun was high and it was wearing listen, a purple listen. top. There's 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 none the of this Anthony, is important. There's the Anthony scenic route of telling a story, and then there's Steph. and then there's Steph. <laughs> That's true. I Did mean, you heard that when we were talking about that on the podcast? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. And, and I love it. You were just like, oh, Leland has a pet peeve. I was like, oh, I know where you're going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Leland does have a pet peeve. You know, the sad part is, is my stories also take a long time. And yeah. I, but I know we all think the same. Well, everything's important. Yeah. <laughs> You gotta know the None pre-story. Of this is <laughs> well, I mean, you that, have to know the pre-story well, to the story, or you could just tell the story like how I told the story in like five minutes. <laughs> we're not you, Jordan. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> um, so, Steph, you were born with eyebrows. It took. Oh, and wait, you first decided of all, to get new ones. <laughs> I was quoted two hours. It's a good thing I went alone because it was four hours again. She spent two hours on makeup again. I could. I could. And watch I was just Avengers like, Endgame. <laughs> Wow. Like, don't get me wrong. Free service. Can't complain. It was I free. Mean, I tipped her. I tipped can. her this time because the last time I didn't real. I I didn't know. Like you tipped her Stup- over. No, yeah. like I tipped her. Do you have to go back? No. Okay, that's good. So this woman. This is was now the touch of, up. She you, you're, she's out of your life forever until i want to go back again if i want to go back again do you have to go back again in like a year or two or whenever it fades to get, to get it redone this isn't permanent it still fades well that is bullshit like aren't tattoos yeah. supposed to stay these are you know your own tattoos do not look as good as they did well, when they first got put on the one still does look pretty good yeah yeah it's uh, very hard Harley? to explain. Yeah. The, the one that was legit from the start yeah, yeah. oh catwoman look rough oh yeah she looks more like no. Halle berry now than she ever did about <laughs> show. Oh, no. I mean, yeah. like everything's just blending together I'm sorry right yeah no um uh facial tattoos or like cosmetic tattoos Technically, aren't really. I don't know. It's hard to explain. They're not that's, really tattoos, that's but fair. there's ink in there sure. that will I, eventually. I feel that's what they say, just so you they can back hike up. Years, they yeah. can hike up the price. Yeah, well, anyway, maybe. Be, uh, you said before the podcast started, it's hurt a little bit more because of the. Yeah. yeah. So she outlined. She first she did the two hours of makeup again, just just redoing it just to make sure it was the shape I wanted. I'm okay. First of all, I'd like to state because I, I haven't really been posting pictures. Also, on the simple fact that I'm aware of my facial structure. If anything, I've been hearing people say it looks more natural than like me having a whole nother shape to my brows that don't even belong on my face. She followed my hairline, so she. I mean, used, that's what you're supposed yeah. to do, yeah. right? Yeah. Like... For some people, no. Oh they no! They can I... shave it and give you any shape you want. Oh sure. no! I watch Drag Race. Yeah. I know what's up. Well, there you yeah. go. <laughs> yeah, like, she tried to stick? do. She tried to do the minimal, like shaving down, and just um, she just outlined what was already there. But the makeup again took two hours because she wanted to just make sure I was happy with what I wanted, and she was the one who was kind of nitpicky about it too. Like I was totally fine with the shape, but she was like, "What if we go a little sharper? What if we have a little more layers?" This, you're fine with this. I was like, I'm fine with this. If you start tattooing now, I'm more than happy I'll, I'll with this. I'll get here before dinner. This is okay. <laughs> this is perfect. Anyways, go up there. Two hours of makeup. Sit down. She starts doing that outline, which is no numbing. That felt 
fine until she started to shade in. Now, she numbs with this, like, cream for, like, ten minutes or so. You don't feel it at, like, the tail of your eyebrow. But as soon as she started going in the right, center, the part. I can feel. In your brain. I can feel it scraping on already scraped skin. Yeah. <laughs> I was just Ooh. like, okay. It was even more stupid because it was like, um, uh, what is it? Like, I knew I was tired because ahead of the, um, before the appointment, she told me the day before to not drink anything, uh, no alcohol, no caffeine, just for like twitching and all that. Did you follow those rules this time? Yes, I did. Oh. I smoked on Saturday. I did not drink. <laughs> okay. So you didn't follow the rules. I was allowed to smoke. Oh, okay. I was okay. allowed to smoke. I okay. just couldn't take like any alcohol. Yeah, alcohol any blood or anything. Thinning it was anything. totally fine. Tattoo was done and then um went to get food because again, I wasn't expecting to be there 4 hours. You went to Ruby Tuesdays. I went to a boba place in I I forgot what exit it is, but it was like like 8 minutes away from Catella going mm-hmm. south. And I so, went so to this still in Anaheim at the time. Yeah, yeah I went to this boba place they also called had Boysenberry Boba. Oh. oh, did they? Yeah. Wow. That sounds good. <laughs> I went to this place called like Class Three Hundred Two, or something right. like that. It was like some boba place, and okay, so I was hungry, and I heard they had popcorn chicken. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna get popcorn chicken, and then I'm gonna get me a drink. And like typical boba is usually in like like a. Really cylinder, like tall, last plastic. Yes. It came in like a chubby bowl like thing, like your cup like that. It was like, like a cafe ounces, style but, like, mug. Yeah. It was like thing. a big circle. Like a soup cup. So I was trying to get food and I was just like, okay, well, how, like, how does your menu work? Cause it was like page one and page two. And then the guy was like, okay, well, you choose from page one and then you choose from page two. And I was like, okay. And I was like, I'll get fried rice and I'll get the popcorn chicken and I'll get the drink. And then he tells me my total and he goes, okay, 1730. Yeah. And I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, and I was like, like 730? And he was like, 1730. And I was just like, did you get a bucket of popcorn shrimp? I got like a whole like I don't know it was a like, whole popcorn chicken. <laughs> I I don't know how to explain it. It's like um I don't I know. You can before, didn't I? It was like five as That's big dumb. as my hand on both. So two hands full of food, which <laughs> fed me that that time after my brows and my lunch for today and my meal before coming here. So, so it sounds so it like was you, worth it. you spent the appropriate amount of money for the food you got. It was fine, but it just know, it didn't off. shock me. I guess I'm living in L.A. for God too long. She said that. I was like, yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, so. I mean, Shit. <laughs> I, I work yeah. in downtown. I'm like, yeah, that sounds Yeah, every normal. meal is 20 bucks these days. I right? yeah. immediately got sleepy on the ride down. So that's why I was going that's in nice and out girl. of uh, Instagram Live because I I know it's horrible. I'm not touching it. It's um, it was every time I pick up my phone to look at uh, Instagram. It's Steph has started a live thing, and yeah. I would, I'm like, I'll check that out. Oh, she's just driving. Yeah, I was I driving and talking. I don't need to watch my friend drive. Someone I've, would talk to me because I was just I I've, was so I've, I've seen tired. people drive before. I'm good. You could call someone. Yeah, but no one was answering, or no one didn't seem like talking. So I was like, you know what? Maybe this is my alone drive. Well, it was the day of Jesus' rebirth. That so, is true. You know. Um, How did the day end? Uh, it was just whatever. I mean, if anything, <laughs> I have to share. Friday, I went to different dispensaries. Trying did you go to, to like, SDRC? Buy- um, yes, I did. Um, Without us? Sorry, y'all didn't. No one was answering me. I didn't ain't reach no out one, either. No one reached out to me. So... Um, I brought a pen. How to put I think I already said that earlier. Properly. Without me. being mean. What? <laughs> I'm a pothead. Don't say it. I'm not. Do, do, do you need help? No. Because um, I heard the WrestleMania discussion. Oh, God. <laughs> I mean. Uh, right, that, what that, you heard uh, also, was also, everything hitting the last two, also, fucking hour. Fuck hiking. Why? Don't. Two, and, two, uh, two, thing, two things. Uh, <laughs> two things about. About. The, the stories of how high Steph got. Yeah. One, uh, we were kind I'm of concerned. posting it up for fun. Sure. Because it was funny. And two, it's all 100% true. Yep. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 
I, she was gone. Yeah. Yeah, I was a mess. I mean, not and you a guys, mess. Just and you know what's upsetting about that episode? Y'all didn't even talk about WrestleMania. Oh yeah, <laughs> and I, I was so like. <laughs> when, when are they going to get to the fireworks I'm, factory? I'm, I'm, I'm like, I'm, that's called clickbait. I'm like, uh, <laughs> yeah, and I called it Steps uh, Steps Road to uh, WrestleMania. Yeah. Oh, yeah, or as uh, I was informed, because um, you know. Because I now follow wrestlers on Instagram, um, Finn Balor likes to take these very suggestive shots where the <laughs> belt is hanging over his crotchular area, and I was informed, "Oh, Leland, that's called the thirst trap." And I was like, <laughs> "I was like, oh, well, then I am thirsty <laughs> because right. because I turn into Leslie Jones talking to Steph or a Colin when I when I look at him, I'm just like, "Ooh, come here, you little marshmallow." <laughs> Um, the demon dude. eat the fuck off though. That thing's stupid. Fuck you. It's dumb. I it's dumb. He because looked it, like a nasty Rastafarian. It's, it's, like, it's, it's dumb. Wow. Like, <laughs> it's dumb because it randomly pops up. Like there's no real build up or anything to yeah. it. If they built it as a character, and then that's to say, if they built anybody like a character, it could be great. But if it just shows up, then fuck all. It's it it's just dumb. seemed like yeah, I agree. Like he was just like I'm the demon. Does yeah. your wrestling style change? No. Not really. You do nothing be, different. It'd except be great if you did, you too. You just pull your tongue out a, a lot. <laughs> cool. But that but, tongue, though. But sure. But it's just kind of like, cool. You have a... It was the first time I thought, um, who's the the black guy he fought with? Um, um, Bobby Lashley? The, the eye thing he had in? like the, yeah, yeah. That was cool. I was yeah. like, unexplained. I was like, nice. You finally look interesting now. <laughs> and then, yeah. the, you know, on a Monday Night Raw, you know what he did? He took him out. Yeah. I was like, now you're back to just being you boring finally with your big You don't look like dress. Apollo Crews or the other Titus one. Titus O'Neil. You, or, or, you don't look like Titus Shelton O'Neil. Shelton Benjamin. Shelton Benjamin, that's the one. Uh, I mean, I, the, uh, I felt so sorry for Alexis having to stand that close to Hogan. Like, yeah. I was just like, ew. She yeah. looked a little, she looked, she knew, she was like, he's a rapist and a racist. Like, why are, why did you bring him out? Like, when, like, when, when he's like putting, putting the guns up yeah, and he's trying yeah. to get her too, she, she's like, man, sign off for this. Yeah, she, mm, yeah. yeah. Um, she is great though. So I, know, I so enjoy I her greatly. I don't know how she's good at wrestling, but. She's pretty good. She, okay, great. She's on. pretty good. She's yeah. Uh, I'm following her on both Instagram and Twitter. She's fun. She <laughs> I think she's fantastic. Um, she is super Disneyphile. Yeah. I, it's I really think funny. It's, she's adorable. So we watched the shake up the other night. Yeah. Um, a little interesting, like, some yeah. of their choices are really weird. Like, they put all the chicks on SmackDown, and I was like, so who's left on Raw? Becky, Becky. and Lacey? I'm like, yeah. I mean, granted, I'm into that. Yeah. I like that shit. I'm all in that shtick. I'm, I'm still <laughs> mad at Lacey. Why are we mad? Because she's fucking worthless. She spent two months walking out, doing nothing, and now she just gets a title chance. Uh, well, when you blow the right people, that's what happens. Oh, she, no, look, like that tall, blonde, big boobies, that is a Vince McMahon wet dream. Oh, of and course. that's why, <laughs> that's why she's there. Yeah, no, I, I, oh, I get it. Yeah. She, um, she knew Charlotte Flair. Oh, I love Char Char. Char Char. You know, the problem is, is six, six weeks ago when we talked, when I gave you my Royal Rumble rundown. Yeah. And I didn't know the names. Yeah. Oh, we're past that. I now know the names All and the I names. know their stats and I know what they're <laughs> you know doing. Their and indie what, names. Yeah. And the problem is, is I still want to hold on to the, I don't know them anymore. So I, I still call them my nicknames. I know them all. <laughs> um, but I, the only one I really, my nicknames still stick for Shar Shar and, uh, cause I just think it's hilarious and nipples. Um, <laughs> oh, Becky Lynch. Braun no, Strowman. Strowman. Oh. oh. We talked about her <laughs> nipples quite a lot. Yeah. Uh, no, Strowman makes me laugh because they always fall out. Yeah, it's yeah. like, is really, where's, and, and, and like, and Elias, where's that little thin, um. His nipples seem to say, stay, stay close. Yeah. So it's it like, well, why can't you both not but, wear those? But yeah. like, nip, nippleless and Eric Ola, they, they have to just come out and just say hello to the world. Yeah, it's just weird. I'm like, oh look, nipples are back. Uh, I <laughs> don't like the new big guy. We were talking about him the other day. Oh, Lars Sullivan? Fuck that dude. Yeah, he's no, just he's, stupid. He's, he's, we have a big guy. He's a great big guy. Braun Strowman, I think, is awesome. I enjoy him. He's, yeah. he's, he is, I think he's ready for a title, uh, a, like a short title sure. run. Give him any title, honestly. We, like, the dude got nothing. I thought so, be, he's oh, been go boned out of a couple. I'm still mad that he didn't fight Brock and beat Brock. Like, yeah. I yeah, didn't that like, like that. The Titans of the, or the champions of the Titans. Or yeah. yeah but, that would have been way more believable. But Brock fights who he wants to yeah. fight. Oh, really? So fuck yeah. him. <laughs> yeah. Well, he's and Brock, Brock, likes, right? Brock yeah. likes fighting little guys. 
Well, oh. apparently he's going to come back for the next Saudi Arabia bullshit. Oh, God. How fun. Yeah. Um, um, I, I did enjoy the WrestleMania. I had some, my, my minor quick thoughts on it, though, are like, uh, too damn long. Like, it's almost like a day <laughs> event. It's just yeah. like, it's, it's like a Coachella. It is like a, mm, it is, it's weird. Uh, I, I hate how long it takes them to get down to the ring. It's better than last year. I, I saw it last yeah, year. Yeah, yes, it is. Time. It was like I heard you talk about the Undertaker, and I watched that. And I was like, "Oh no, what the <laughs> fuck is this?" Yeah, he took a long get, time. A I, slow walk. I get it. Play his music your three shit. times. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. Um, I hate Shane. I I hate him. I mean, I'm over it at this point. It's I, it's I, I don't hate him as a wrestler because he's not real. Um, and I know that. <laughs> I, and I don't give a fuck real. about his persona. I just don't think he needs to be there anymore. He looks like a dad. He well, is. He is. <laughs> no, but I mean like the dad that's trying to be cool and uh, you're just embarrassed yeah. for him. And like the thing is is with Shane, he's average moderate wrestler at best. Sure. Yeah. But he's just willing to do these ginormous spots. Yeah, he's going to get himself killed. He's yeah. too old to be doing that like, shit. I'm kind of surprised he still goes for it. Granted, yeah. he took a lot. He took a long time off. She There's a long time no he net. was he was not around, huh? No net. No, that's Kurt Angle. Well, that's Kurt Shane friends. is he. I I worry for his health. Yeah, he's done. I, he's he's retired from in ring performance. And they didn't let him win. Well, nope. that, go not, in on your back works. and you go out on your back. Yeah. That's that's kind of fucked up. That's mm. that's old school. Yeah, that's just that's how it wrestling, is. Yeah. Is what is it? You go in on your back and you go out on your back. That's. Yeah, first match in, you you get you you, you lose. lose. Uh, Last match out, you lose. That just seems. I don't know. The man I mean, has, he got the man this, has a gold medal. He got the <laughs> spiritual win, but I I just felt like it was a good show, and I very much enjoyed it. And I thought it was really neat that yeah. the, the women were the main event. Yeah, that's pretty. Um, right. And I thought that was great. Except, oh, the the match that was so ridiculous was the uh, Triple H Batista thing. <laughs> it went on so long, and it looked like two fifty year old men. You know what? It looked like that Danny Trejo, Danny Glover movie. The, what's the um, badasses? Badasses. It just looked like what is? Come on, sit down, Grandpa. And Triple and, H is still really good. I'm not saying they weren't yeah. good at what they did. Dave it Batista. Just, well, there's a reason he. He's, retired. Well, I mean, I mean, he wasn't happy. No. Uh, and then, you know, he wanted to do movies, and he did movies. Uh, but, like, his... He, he's not great. He's just kind of a big dude with, yeah. like, heavy arms. Yeah, but compared to everybody else there, he wasn't even a big dude anymore. Like, right. he got... Like Hollywood muscles and not like workout wrestling muscles. Yeah. Like when the Miz looks better than you, that's a problem. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> like, I mean, granted, like I'm, I like the Miz. I shouldn't, but I do. Like he comes out, I'm like, oh, that boy did good, you know, but like it's interesting to watch it as still not kind of knowing what's going on. Yeah. Uh, like, and like when I asked, uh, Scott the other day, I'm like, so there's WrestleMania and the Royal Rumble. What's the other big one? He was like, oh, Summer Smackdown. And I said, oh, okay. Summer Slam. Summer, whatever. And I was like, Summer something with an S. Uh, and I was like, well, what about all this other bullshit? And he goes, oh, well, no, that's just stuff they do every month. Yeah. I was like, but does it matter? He's just like, well, no. If, if the title's going to yeah. change hands, sure, it changes there. Um, he thought it would be interesting if Becky got a partner and then she gets the other belt and she just yeah. Becky three belts. And I was like, <laughs> 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 um, Positive note with the NXT thing going on. I did very much enjoy my girl Kyrie. Did you watch Takeover? Yeah. Takeover uh, was real fucking I, good. I did enjoy watching Kyrie uh come up to the big leagues with yeah. her stick and and teaming up with Oscar, who frankly they just don't know who to do oh, with man, right I now. Feel so bad for her. I She's do. So good and too. she kind of looked pissed. Like kind of like, yeah. Here I am. Oh. You know. Uh yeah. I'm I'm enjoying it. I don't know how long I'm going to enjoy it for. I was sad, no, my girl's gone for a year. I don't know how that's going to hold me. Um, I mean, she blew out both her ACLs. That's why she wasn't on the end of that her match. She yeah. fell. Oof. Out. Ouch. That's why when you, at the end of that match, only Tamina comes up. I was yeah. just like, where'd my girl go? Oh, yeah. <laughs> ouch. So she's out for like nine months to a year. And I was yeah. like, well, shit. Well, I mean, I, that's why I moved to Shar Shar. <laughs> <laughs> she's still a big old bitch and I like her. So I'm like, I'm, cause I like them big ladies. <laughs> I mean, like, <laughs> and, and admittedly, I don't know why you like uh, uh, Nia Jax so much. I just do. I, 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 just, I can't I, I don't, explain it. I don't get it. I don't. Um, she reminds me of She-Hulk, <laughs> and I love She-Hulk so Char much. Char Char should remind you of She-Hulk. Nah, she's not as green. You know? Green? I, 
<laughs> Nia Jax is a beautiful person. I liked her YouTubes. <laughs> oh, like, okay. Should I follow her on Instagram? Her, she, yeah. her and Charlotte are best friends. They she's hang a good out all person. the time. Yeah, she, she's just also, been, she's she's she looks like heel. She looks like The Rock, and I like that. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Lady Rock. She looked like Lady Rock. Like if you were to put the Rock and drag, Nia Jax, and that's why I like it. I just, I, I think I like them both. <laughs> uh, how are how uh, how into Hobbs and Shaw are you? I'm into it as much as I'm into any other Fast and Furious. I Fears can't movie. fucking wait. It'll like, be a while before. I'm not gonna see really? it opening weekend. I, I would think because it's it's. The Rock. Actually, I'm kind of pissed that I don't have a screening for it because that's a movie I don't want to pay for. Really, even even like the the it Rock. It don't need my money. No, it it's don't. It's gonna make a billion dollars. It's yeah, because like, I will watch it 18 million yeah, times. Like, like, none of these movies need our ten dollars, but ten. Whew, that'd be great. <laughs> oh yeah, we're going to Grossmont, man. Yeah, ten dollars. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, damn, that's, I miss that's, ten dollar movie theaters. <laughs> let me tell you that. And that's online. Yeah, that's um, why San Diego's the best city. Eight <laughs> fifty at wrong. the door. Like, there's nothing. Look, I'm excited to see it. I figured it. you'd really, you'd, you know what it is. Like after getting I, so so gushy over like him pulling the fucking concrete no, bench and, I and love curling it. it, it to me, <laughs> the entire movie looks like him pulling yeah. the concrete bench and and, and I'm gonna love it. it here's, here's for the, two here's, hours. Here's the thing, I the movie don't come out to like June or some shit. You got too much. It's too much before that. I can't be that excited for it. Yeah. There's a lot about to happen in the next five days that's going to change it's my true. entire life. It's I need true. to wait. Avengers, dragons. I oh mean, the Pikachu. I oh. heard that is fantastic. Yeah. It looks so it, good. I, I heard yeah. if you're not a Pokemon fan, yeah. you will most likely enjoy it more because you have no Fuck okay. to good. About All right, glad. works for me. Works uh, for me. But if you're a Pokemon fan, you're probably gonna hate it because that's just how it's not gonna fit canon. Yeah. That's oh, how... I don't give a shit about that. No, I just love goddamn Pokemon in real it, life. It, it's kind of like my 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 joke at the store for the last couple of weeks, and and I've said it a lot because it's been the topic of conversation. Is no one hates Star Wars like a Star Wars fan? It's true. Hmm. Like, and I've had to hear all of them complain. <laughs> What are they? What are they complaining about? Oh, this is JJ. Oh, this is their title stupid. Oh, oh God! Like, shut are, up. Are, are they mad that it's not Rain Johnson anymore? They're mad to be mad. Yeah. Did you? Did you? No see, one likes I mean, Star it, Wars. It, it depends on like person to person. Yeah, they all have something just, to be mad yeah. about. Did you see that dude that tweeted two years ago? Saying that episode nine is going to be called "The Rise of Skywalker" and the Emperor's back. No. What? Two years ago, a dude tweeted this out. Is that confirmed? Uh, uh, yeah, it's not, it's not, that's, that's not like someone's Disney Photoshop. Does he work for Disney? <laughs> that's not like someone's Photoshop. Okay, like, do you all tweet? see that, 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 that fake out, um, what looked like it would have been like, hey, I'm walking through an office and I have my phone out. I'm going to take a snap of that screen right there. And it was, it said Fantastic Four. No. 2021. I didn't see that. Oh, I went straight to one of my guys. I was like, yeah. is real? <laughs> he goes, fuck no. <laughs> uh, let's see. D- where's the date? Oh, there it is. November. Is he just some random dude? Yeah, I think oh. it's just some random guy. I don't get this. Why does it say 21 November 12th? No, no. Oh, 2012. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, bitch, don't look at me like that. <laughs> Everybody can hear your silence. <laughs> <laughs> November 21st, 2012. Star Wars Episode 7, Rise of Skywalker, The Emperor Lives. Uh, and this is legit tweet. Yeah. It's insane. Yeah, it's a legit tweet. I mean, I do think the title is dumb. I don't. I'm tired. Anything that rises or is risen or wrote, I'm, I'm done. I'm Honestly, good. I'm outside good. of the original two, like Star Wars, Empire, Return, A New Hope is fine, but uh, but no one call it that. Yeah, I mean, outside of those, they're all dumb. I do like the Phantom Menace because it does imply something cool. Well, who was the Phantom Menace? Exactly. <laughs> uh, I, I, yeah, I don't, I just don't like the title. I thought the trailer was really fun. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, you know, it was I, neat. I got it's, into it's, some it's very better, intense conversation. It's, it's <laughs> better when it's, uh, synced up with, uh, What's Up Danger from oh, the Spider-Verse. Dude, I gotta, I gotta watch that. What? Oh, okay. You know, um, in Spider Verse, oh, I saw that. Okay, yeah, 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 don't yeah. you roll no, your I, eyes? It, it, I saw that it was on YouTube. I was it's like, rad. I was like, oh, that's something I won't watch. Um, <laughs> I liked. I look. I thought in the Spider Verse was fantastic. Mm-hmm. I did not love it. I very much enjoyed it. My 
only real issue was it is that because reading the actual book itself, oh. they didn't put my two spider people, my favorites in there. And I'm like, <laughs> I'll wait to the sequel before you become my favorite. Yeah, p- punk rock Spider-Man will get there. Oh, punk, punk and br- spider Brit, son. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Cause he got that Union Jack suit. I love, uh, I do, I enjoyed it. I thought it was a very good movie. Yeah. Um, and who knew that I wanted Chris Pine to be Spider-Man? Right. right? He had like five lines, yeah. and Solid. I cried at every single one of them <laughs> because that man is a goddamn national treasure. Even through voice acting, it was like you are the best. He is such a good Peter. Everybody. Still, still like number five of the Chris's. He probably one or two, depending on the day. Well, Pratt, well, Pratt probably dropped for well, you. Pratt, mm, him and Evans, they tie for the bottom, depending on really? the day. Really, Evans too now? He's a douchebag. Is he? Really? He's Captain Bro America, man. I like, mean, he's broy, but he yeah. doesn't seem like a douchebag. I don't know. He, he seems fine. like a pretty good dude. I know thumb stuff. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> he knows thumb stuff. I know yeah. thumb stuff. Uh, no, it's, I think why those, uh, Hemsworth and, um, Pratt, why they, or uh, Pine couldn't work out their bullshit for the next Star Trek? Because they knew America can't handle that much pretty on a screen. <laughs> Wait, do they have issues with each other? Because not, not necessarily. In, they're it not was, in the movie at the same time. They are not. But the, part four was going to be a time travel story where oh. they were going to George Kirk was going to fall out of time and have to hook up with Captain Kirk, and they were going to go on a space adventure. That seems unnecessary. A hundred percent. But every four. Oh, and that would have been the fourth one. Every four Star Trek movies is a time, time travel. <laughs> it's just how it is. And the problem with that is... Back um, to the well. Yeah, <laughs> Even in this new-ass universe. Yeah. The, 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 but the problem is the rumor around the line is that there could not be a solid contract negotiation mm-hmm. of who gets the higher top billing or pay on that. Mm. Frankly, my thoughts is you both get paid a lot. Shut the fuck up and do your job. Yeah. I'm talking to you, Jennifer Lawrence. Your makeup for X Phoenix <laughs> looks dumb. She wearing a wig and that makeup is so light these my, days. Uh, it's okay. She's gone in the first 20. I don't, we don't know that. <laughs> my for, solution, for fact, my solution yeah. to the, the Star Trek, although I don't want that movie. Mm. My solution <laughs> though is just Chris. <laughs> <laughs> I want to throw the penguin at you, but I can't <laughs> because it's a good idea. <laughs> also, I think, you know, I think the bottom line, honestly, I th- there's probably the negotiation contract, but I, mean, I think the truth really comes down to it. Yeah. Anton died and they don't want to recast him. Mm, and I think that's yeah. totally fair. And it's if fair. they would just be like, we don't feel like moving forward without the full cast we started with, respect, yeah. bow it out. We have TV back. Yeah. It is better than ever. Discovery rocks. I mean... Picard started filming today. Meh. <laughs> he actually threw it. He actually threw it that time. <laughs> you don't talk shit about Grandpa Stewart. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I don't know why I should be excited. You for, don't need to. It's for, not for you. It's for I me. I have watched a lot of Star Trek not, in my time. Then you should be excited. <laughs> I like Next Gen. I feel it is really solid in its time. I don't know why we need to go back and pull characters 20 more than 25 years ago and and not just try and create new characters. Because they all officially feel that show did not get a proper send-off. The last movie is awful. Sorry? (laughs) Yeah, well, we live in a time where things come back. You know what? I think you just butt her because Firefly can't and Star Trek can't. So I think that's just what Firefly, it is. Firefly still can. Everyone's still alive. Everyone's doing very well. Not everybody's alive. Who's not alive? Uh, if Wash ain't in it, why am oh, I watching oh, the show? Oh, I, I was thinking of the actors. No, fuck that. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like I'm brother, you're not in it? Why am I here? I'm not going to watch it because Shepard Book is gone too. Exactly. I was like, oh, but he did die. He did. Yes, he, he did. did die in real life. Yeah. yeah. But his character died first, so yeah, it's so, okay. It's okay. It's, it's canon. I mean, <laughs> it's. <laughs> but now they can't do like a prequel story before Serenity. <laughs> oh, we hire another guy. Pre-entity? <laughs> Pre-entity? Ooh, I think that cleared up. Uh, I do think it's interesting though that we do live in this world where like shows like Star Trek or, um, Star Trek. Hi, I'm a newbie. Star Trek or like other, I don't know, Dynasty can come back. You know, shit that no one care about. But it's like, <laughs> It's neat that we live in a streaming service world where people are like, hey, you want to give a shot to that show that really kind of didn't work or one that did? And, you know, that's cool. I'll pay for it. I mean, we all are, essentially. Yeah. It's, you know, me and my dad just cut the cord. 
Oh, yeah? And he's kind of like, I don't know where to watch TV now. I'm like, I got you, boo. Don't worry. Yeah. I was like, you, I had a, I had I was like, you need to get an Apple TV. He goes, what is that? Come over here, son. Let me teach you <laughs> let me, about the future. Let me educate you. Yeah. Let me show you the future. We're all going to hell in a handbasket, and we're just riding it out. Hey, That's wrong. why in-game is so important. <laughs> <It's> oh, like, <laughs> I mean, I like, look, I, I had some friends that saw it already. I know some people who worked on it. Nate kind of told me what was going on. I'm not going to spoil anything because I'm not Is everybody all. that you know that has seen it happy? Yeah. I mean, okay. as far oh, as wow. it's the movie you've been waiting for. Yeah. I okay. mean, I, the, 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 my friend Julian said he would be sitting at work and he would find himself welling up in tears. Just thinking and about just it. Just thinking oh, about shit. it. And then he'd be like, yeah, this is this is a good movie. You know what I mean? I would not be surprised if they don't fucking give Robert Denny Jr. like an Academy Award nomination for this shit. Mm. Like I've been told, he's that fucking good. And nice honestly, to... he's been playing the role for ten years. Yeah, probably should just get a nomination. He don't gotta win, but wouldn't it be cool if he did? Like Tony Stark wins an Oscar. Yeah, that, that, <laughs> he comes up as Tony Stark. Yo, oh, yeah, yeah. In is the he armor? kind of already <laughs> Tony Stark? <laughs> But he comes up in the Iron Man suit yeah. that would be <laughs> with a tie. Yeah, be amazing. <laughs> be so happy. Or at the very least, just have have the thing on his chest, you know? Yeah. I mean, you know what? That doesn't seem too far from a possibility. Like I, okay, you heard about the Reddit thing, right? No. Like some person claimed they saw the movie and they posted everything on Reddit. Oh, I did hear about right. that. Right, I read it. Wrong. It, it's a hundred percent wrong because there are things that happened in it. Where I was like. Yeah, but I, I know that actor isn't in that movie because mm. that would have made news. I don't care oh. how secretive you can be. Yeah, that bitch don't walk on a set without someone knowing. Yeah. Like it just. <laughs> so I, also, they were talking about like, oh, Riri Williams has a cameo. No, she don't. And yeah. if she does, then goddamn. But like, no one outside of comics knows what the fuck a Riri is. True. It's true. So I like, why know. would you have that in I a movie? I thought you meant Rihanna. Ex- no, nope. Rihanna. Rihanna. She plays Riri. Oh, no. She's too old. It's, it's yeah. Rihanna, by the way. Oh. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> it's Rihanna, all right? <laughs> Which I honestly thought they were saying Rihanna the whole time. I didn't know that until, like, recently. I knew a Rihanna when I was a kid, so I did. I thought that because I knew a person named Rihanna. Well, no, I, didn't know, I didn't realize it was Rihanna. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I've been singing it for years, Rihanna. Yeah. And it was pointed out. Within the last month. <laughs> <laughs> you were this year's old. Yeah. No. Um, well, did you ever watch SNL's uh, Boo Boo Jeffries? No. No. We need to stop this fucking show right now. <laughs> Boo Boo Jeffries? Boo Boo Jeffries. We'll watch it collectively All right. when we're done. All right. Uh, no. Uh, you know what, audience? Just look up Boo Boo Jeffries and enjoy. Every, yeah, everyone out there and we'll SNL, all catch up Boo Boo together. Jeffries. <laughs> <laughs> we'll all catch up together. Uh, you want to wrap this shit up? Yeah, let's get out of here. Because I listened to your last show. It took you 10 minutes to close out last week. Sometimes it's not my fault. I, Sometimes it's mine. Oh, I, I know. I just wasn't going <laughs> to I wasn't gonna judge stuff, you. Stuff pops up, and then I was like, I didn't talk about this. Is there anything you need to talk about tonight? Not that I can think Are of. Are you sure? Yeah. All good? Because of my, uh, since I have HBO now, now again. Jordan slowing things down. <laughs> because of HBO now again, uh, I started watching this documentary called The Inventor. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it's about this lady who her her idea was to create this new type of blood test that you just have to do like a little finger prick. Uh Uh-huh. Then they'd be able to diagnose whatever thing you have and it'd be open to normal ass people. Like, you want your blood, blood to be Mm -hmm. tested? You could do it yourself. Uh Uh-huh. Go to this place, they'll take it. They'll send you the results. And it'll give you like the whole like odds of getting this and this and like what. Yeah. Like, can, can they fix my caffeine problem? So the only <laughs> problem was n- this technology does not exist, uh, and she's just a con artist. <laughs> oh, so it's the fire festival yes. of medical. Yes, yes, it's exactly that. Oh well, wow. then I hate her. And it's yeah. so fucking amazing. Oh, I'll, I'll watch it because it's the fire festival thing. But on a much on a scientific much, scale, a much much. So in other words, scale. white privileged people weren't the only ones hurt. Yeah, because mm. she got generals and presidents to talk to her. <laughs> it's wait, wait. fucking crazy. Oh, current president? Current president? Not current president. Oh, because he don't. Yeah. The last one, though. Uh, <laughs> Damn. That means someone told him he should talk to her. Mm. It, it's fucking crazy. I mean, I believe the current one, but... <laughs> He'd be like, what's blood? <laughs> I don't have that. I don't have that. I'm, I'm, I have the best blood ever. My blood is pure stock. It's, it's just black sewage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Made of, uh, fish fillets and fucking, uh, Big Macs. Uh, Alright, let's get 
out of here. The man's uh, more unhealthy than you. How come he didn't have a heart attack yet? Like, because, I don't know. He I'm pretty sure on, I've been having a heart attack since yesterday. His life, he runs on a battery. <laughs> Another one of those weeks. <laughs> oh, I have a pain in my side for two days. That's not good. I, in your defense, though, I mean, you don't sleep on a good mattress. It could be that as well. It's not in my back. Uh, that don't mean nothing for a mattress. It's in my organs? Yeah. The, 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 okay, cool. Uh, I have a bad bed, and that's why my organs hurt. <laughs> okay. do, do you sleep on your side a lot? No? Oh, Is it not oh. your liver? Does it pee when you hurt? I, does, does it, it pee hurt when, when I hurt? Does it hurt when you pee? <laughs> and not in the yeah, burning. Any, I got a problem. Anytime, with. anytime I hurt, I pee a little, <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> no, but Aww. if you if you like hurt when you pee, and not in the like I got something something disease, but more like hey, maybe there's something wrong. No, maybe you got to go see the, uh, the 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 urethra doctor. <laughs> no, and he's gonna shove something up your penis, and we get to hear all about that story next you week. You absolutely urethra would, urethra Franklin. <laughs> Can I call that now? <laughs> <laughs> What you? <laughs> no, it doesn't. It doesn't hurt when I pee. Uh, Steph, what was your question? Uh, is it, is it your liver? I don't know where my liver is. Well, because my gallbladder p- pain was like I felt it in my chest. I don't know where my liver is. <laughs> That's the title of this podcast. <laughs> All right, you named it. What if you have an ulcer? I don't know. I just know it hurts. Can you go to the doctor? Oh, With, you, you've listened to this show, yeah, right? He like he won't want, do he won't any of it. When something hits your stomach, does it hurt? A little bit. Mm. Have you? What are you taking for it? Nothing. Well, if it's an ulcer, then most things I have are not good for it. As, aspirin and ibuprofen are not are not good. Yeah. They are not good to mix either, by the way. So do that. Separately. Especially with the alcohol, stomach bleeding. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, enough of this <laughs> diagnosing <laughs> Anthony's problems, because uh, you know. All right. Maybe we'll see me next week. Uh, <laughs> be sure to tune into the podcast. You can do so by following us on the social medias, Leland. Uh, you can follow me at. Leland. <laughs> nope, not you. What? I've been, you've, not, you've been checking out at the end, don't you? I've always checked out at the end. What ha- what'd you say? <laughs> What's our social medias? Oh, fuck if I know. I just follow them. You made this podcast. Everyone owes you. No, no. I brought for, us for together. This podcast that is, thing. That's where the magic stopped for me. <laughs> oh, that was L-O-R-C podcast mm-hmm. at that yep. stuff. <laughs> where? On Instagram, the Twitter, the Facebook. Good. I don't know. Stitcher Premium. You, nope. Facebook that's, that's Plus. That's someone else's job. That's someone else's Google job. Google Plus. <laughs> we're, guys, we're on Disney Plus. Check it out. We're uh, launching in spring. That'd, that'd be cool. Uh, cool. Steph? Yes. How do people subscribe to this podcast? Uh, you can find us on Google Play now, apparently. Um, really? Yeah. Stephen Henry says Stephen we're there. Stephen Henry told us oh, we're snap. there. Jonathan, get up on it. Yeah. So we're on Google Play you can find us on Stitcher, iTunes, iHeartRadio, Spotify. Those are the good ones. That's. Did that's you mention? Did you mentioned Apple Podcasts. I yeah. got distracted with right? a t- with a. I think you said that tweet. iTunes. Apple, no, no, no. Apple Podcasts. Apple yeah. Podcasts. Apple, we're we're, Apple we're starting to be official about it. There you go. Uh, Jordan. Yes, sir. If they if someone was to not uh, be up on social media but still wanted to contact us. How would they do so? They could email us at lrcpodcast at gmail.com. Has anyone ever done that? No. Cool. No one has ever emailed in the history of my podcasting. Wow. <laughs> yes. I'm ever. sure people have questions. They just I don't think they do or they yeah. would email. I mean Leland? Yeah. yeah. I would really appreciate it if you took a jelly bean before we go. Nope. I listen to that show. <laughs> You got a 50-50 nope. chance. Nope. You won't You won't have my luck. I will. Where I didn't have a single good one. No, here's why I won't have those jelly beans. Because they're not the things. official Harry Potter ones, so fuck this bamboozle bullshit. Um, <laughs> this fucking bougie <laughs> motherfucker here. God. Everyone is disappointed. I just want you to know that. Uh, I'm full of disappointment. <laughs> well, why don't you tell them where they can uh, point their disappointment to? Oh, you can point your disappointments and uh, all your non-emailing needs to uh, Leland Pierce Art, The Spook Easy on Instagram and Facebook. Yeah, it's a good show. Maybe next time I'll have to have my shit together and mention a lot of stuff on it. <laughs> I blame you guys. <laughs> so, you haven't even been on this podcast for a while. Six weeks. <laughs> Could be eight. I'm not positive. <laughs> so so quick with I, just, I miss you. I miss you too, buddy. I don't yeah. think that's true. 
You we don't. shout you out yeah, all I the know. time. I know. I get. You know what? Honestly, when I'm not mentioned for like the first hour, I get kind of irritated. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Man, how long do I got to hear about myself?" <laughs> you damn, old, you I, ego monster. <laughs> I mean, you're you're still on the on the artwork. So yeah, I keep me, I keep you. I, I've sent you like three texts in the last year. Like, I'm always making new artwork. Yeah, I never do. <laughs> I want to. It's on my goals of things to do in 2019. <laughs> if, if I could get like a, a picture of it, I'll just Photoshop stuff over your face. <laughs> but it'll, it'll still oh, send you a picture. Keep... It'll still be your face, but with long hair. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like both of us. <laughs> the problem we're gonna, is we're gonna put tattoo eyebrows on. You know the shitty part is I actually hate that photo. The only one on that photo that I think is drawn good is you. Sweet. Like I do I, think you look the best. I don't like yours, and I don't like mine. Yeah. And I was like, one, you and me change our hairstyles so frequently yeah. that there's no point to keep it. But you still looks fly with your fro, so it's mm. like, well, shit. <laughs> um, but now, uh, but you wanted me to draw a bunch of you guys as Overwatch characters at one point. It was an idea. It wasn't over. You it don't was, have to commit to it. Crazy. Sure. We'll take anything. But the problem is, is I couldn't commit to who I thought was what. I really feel we nailed this down. I'm, I don't think we I'm, I'm either Lucio or uh, Batiste. <laughs> I feel you I look more Batiste, like yeah. Batiste because you got the hair now. Lucio's got the same hair. Yeah, but I think your hair looks more like <laughs> Batiste than, than Batiste uh, Lucio. Batiste is like short, knobby hair. No, don't, that's racist. Don't say that. Um, but no, his hold on, new, hold on, his, hold on. <laughs> can I get a read, uh, can I get a reading on that? Can I, can I get a, was that racist? With a black report? <laughs> Minority Wait, report. what did you say? Do you say nobby? Nobby. Oh, that's not what I heard. What? Hmm. Did what hmm. you hear? I heard nappy. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. Of course not. I thought you were like turning into the guy that was like called him nappy hose. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, 10 years ago. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I was like, don't say that. Um, yeah, so those are the things you can follow me at. All right, continue. Steph, Stephanoids, go. Oh, yeah, you could, um, message me on Instagram and Twitter at Stephanoids, S-T-P-H-U-H-N-O-I-D-S. Slide into them DMs. Mm-hmm. Hey, she's given car blanche. People can slide into her DMs now. Interesting. You can ask me questions. Yeah. Never happens. No, because they <laughs> I mean, I got a comment. They don't one fucking time, email. Why were they asking <laughs> Jordan, you can find me on most sh- social media platforms and the PlayStation Network at Jordan is a bear. <laughs> Unify Brandon Boysenberry. Damn. <laughs> You fucked me up, man. I had something. <laughs> and then Boysenberry. <laughs> I said it earlier. Yeah, he did. That's where I got it from. Yeah, he stole it. Did you oh. think it was funny then? No, because I didn't hear it. Mm. I thought it was funny. That's why I, I brought it back up again. Right. Yeah. All right. Uh, then if you want to have sex with me, find me at Graphite Night on the Twitter uh, and not on the Instagram because I'm not there. So until next week, I'm Anthony. I'm Jordan. I'm confused. <laughs> Is that really how you want people to find you now? Bye. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying, like, if you start having sex with random people that you meet on Instagram, I think you might have some more pains. I mean, I screen them. Yeah. Like, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I'm Leland. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>